party. Hello? Is everyone here? Good. Then let's get this show rolling. Hi, all Dylan. Y'all doing good? I'm doing pretty good. Very, very excited while simultaneously very, very nervous because, um, well, you saw the title. We're going to be doing Yanga Rumpa V3 today, this week, for our fucking stream. Um, I'm... Besides the fact that Danganronpa, another episode, Ultra Despair Girls, that is a goddamn mouthful to say. So I'm just gonna go with another episode. Um, despite the fact that another episode, besides the fact that, oh, another episode, I can't fucking speak. <clears throat> I was excited, not just because Despair Girls was a bit, um, boring, like I would have ranted about in the video, in the, in the VOD, but I had to download the VOD, but it got copyright claimed because of the the uh, fucking ending credits theme, but whatever, that's a lot of the can of worms. But also because I've heard a lot of decisive things about this game in particular. Like some people are saying this is the best game of the franchise, some people are saying this ruined the franchise, but I don't know. I don't know what the consensus is, but I am super curious to see just what this game does differently. I know it does a few things differently. Apparently it does, uh, Apparently, it expands on some of the mechanics from from Danganronpa 2. The debate scrums are, 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 from what I've heard, really entertaining. I don't know oh, if, how good I'm going to be with them, but, you know, it's worth a shot, I suppose. <laughs> uh, but enough talking. Let's get into this, shall we? Super excited for this. Play the game, damn it! Please tell me this is gonna launch in full screen. For the love of God, please tell me this is gonna launch in full screen. Please? 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 Launch in full screen for mommy? Please? <laughs> that sounds weird. God damn it. <clears throat> It didn't launch in full screen. God damn it. Ah, the old alt enter trick works. Just like in Despair Girls. Maybe this will be. Maybe this won't be too. Download it to Yeah, 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 yeah. All characters appearing in this game are fictional and resembling real persons alive or dead. It's purely coincidental. Hey, just like Persona. This is a. That's odd. Normally these things start with a, a little introduction. You're gonna just gonna skip over the introduction this time? Why'd you start on mode game? I haven't played this game yet. Unless it's a secret. Nope. No secret. <clears throat> if you load save data from the demo version, you will unlock a special reward. I didn't play the demo version. Select which voice language you want to use. You can change from options in the main menu. I'll go with English. I've been going with English for every other Danganronpa game up until now, so why not, right? Logic difficulty, normal, mean, kind. You always start with normal. I, but then it, I've always screwed up even on normal, so. What is happening? This is just spoiling the entire franchise at this point. Jesus. This is showing it. <laughs> this is just showing everything. Oh god, Ultra Despair Girls. Don't remind me of that. Christ. Okay, I, 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 I talk shit on Ultra Despair Girls. I don't actually hate it. It's just meh to me. Wait, that's from the anime, isn't it? I got that 
crazy, right? That's from the anime? Story is not over. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm playing this. A new killing game will begin again. Well, come on! Chop, chop! I want to get to it! Come on! Team Danganronpa! Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> oh. Nothing. No light, no sound. Is the game quiet for anybody else? I can't tell. It's really quiet for me, but I don't know if it's quiet in the thing. No form, no voice, no knowledge of who I am. Who am I? Who am I? I extend a hand. <clears throat> My guy's writing a soliloquy here. A hand belongs to no one. To take hold of my existence. Oh. Oh, it's you! This is me. Yes, it's you. My name is Kaede Akamatsu. Mm -hmm. I just remembered who I am. <laughs> okay. Uh... What's going on? Did the game crash? I clicked to progress the... Hello? What's going on here? Yeah, you remember who you are. What the... What the... Oh, thank God. Nice to meet me. What? I'm the protagonist of this crazy story. Or so you think. Yeah, I kind of got spoiled for this character in particular, but... Eh, I'm not going to spoil it for anybody else. <clears throat> You'll see when we get through. I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. Mm -hmm. I couldn't even embrace Frampak as the blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Mm-hmm. But thanks to that pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Huh? Huh? Oh, wait, where am I? What is this place? I rubbed my throbbing forehead, yet this is definitely going to leave a bump. I looked around. Mm-hmm. A classroom? Dude, this already looks way better than the other games. Not that the other games look bad, but... Damn, this is cool! Yeah, this is a classroom, all right, but I don't recognize it. Where am I? What am I doing here? I am so worried that the game might be coming off as really quiet, so, um... God, I wish I could... Give me a second. Oh, it's on the highest... This is the highest it'll go, God damn it! Like, is this quiet for anybody else? I, I'm really worried this might be quiet. All right. Well, we'll get to that point when we cross it. Oh, is this a dream? I, I just have to pinch myself, right? So I. <laughs> the fucking sound effect. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. So I pinched my cheek. But all I did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. Um. Um. Okay. Hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end I just couldn't... Oh, Jesus fucking Christ! The hell was that? <coughs> Suddenly the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noise. As, fearful, as I fearfully turned around, the locker slowly moved open and... There's the other protagonist! A boy came stumbling out. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student too. No shit. 
He looked bewildered, and when he slowly lifted his head... He screamed as if he'd just seen a monster, fell on his butt and scooted back. Who are you? Are you those other guys? Huh? What other guys? The people who kidnapped me! Um... I kidnapped? Wait! Where am I? What are you gonna do to me? Hey! Hey, hold on! I firmly grip his shoulders. You know? What's your name? Huh? Huh? Uh, um... I'm Suichi Saihara. I'm probably butchering that horribly. Yeah. I'm Kaede Akamatsu. Now, listen to me, Suichi. Shut, Shut up! You're not the only one who's confused right now! Huh? Why are you being so hostile towards him, dude? Like, you would be in the same situation as he was if you're the one who came out second. Like, fuck's sake! Uh, uh sorry. No, not auto. Not auto. I was just trying to progress the, the dialogue through with the keyboard while I drank titty milk. I still can't say <laughs> I still can't say that with a straight face. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Not sponsored. After making him shut up, I retraced my steps again. <clears throat> um... We, uh, we gonna... Hello? Game? Game? You there? Hello? <laughs> Is this supposed to happen? Is this normal? This feels... This doesn't feel normal. Ah, there we go. There's a text box. That's right. I was kidnapped too. I was walking my usual route to school when all of a sudden someone shoved me into a car. I shouted for help, but no one came to rescue me. Everyone pretended like nothing happened. It made me think how rotten the world is. The and then fuck? I lost consciousness. That's right. When I woke up, I was inside that locker. Huh? Same with me. We were kidnapped by the same people. Seems like it. Jeez. But why me? My family's not rich and I'm no one special. I'm just a normal high school girl. There's no reason to kidnap me. Uh, okay. Me neither. I'm just a regular guy. And this is a school, right? But why did they take us to a school? Um. I wonder why. Going from the girl character to the boy character is very jarring, but I'll do my best. Hey, hey there. <clears throat> I'm sure you're confused right now. You're thinking, where am I? Well, I can't explain that, but I can give a basic explanation about the controls. Use the left stick. Left stick? But I'm on, I'm on keyboard and mouse. I just pretend you have a controller, kid. Use the left stick to control the reticle on screen. Now, ah, damn it, wrong button again. When you have a target on your sights, press the A button or left click to investigate. The right stick controls your view! Just use that WASD. Get a good look at your surroundings! You can also press the right bumper, I don't know what button that would be on a keyboard or mouse, to smack objects around! Who knows? You might so find something amazing! You can always press the left bumper for her to return objects to their original position, so relax! However, uh, not every object can be moved. Thanks for understanding! If you press the Y button, a mysterious investigative power will activate. Let's hope that's Tab. <clears throat> Spitting everywhere. Ah, uh, sorry. I know this is a lot of information. And also the wrong buttons. You know, because keyboard and mouse. You know. But if you forget anything, you can always press whatever that button is to review the controls. I keep thinking E is going to progress the dialogue normally, but it just puts me into auto. Investigate this place thoroughly. That's how you progress the story, you know. I, I, I wasn't trying to... Hang on. What button do I... That's the... Not it. It's F3 this time? 
Why would you make it F3? Oh my god. I might have to actually get a controller for this. I am praying this one will work. And it's all tangled. Ah! <laughs> of course! Fucking course! Oh my god! Oh! Everything's going horribly wrong! I'm sorry. I'm trying my best. Jesus Christ. I hate this bullshit. Alright. Praying this works. It's not working. This is not... <sighs> okay. Alright, calm down. It's fine. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. I'll figure this out eventually. Just <laughs> let me fiddle around with the fucking keyboard real quick. Oh, it's Q and E. For, for right bumper and left bumper. Though, excuse me, what the fuck? How do I get it to the, to do the fucking keyboard? I'm playing on a keyboard. <sighs> okay. So, hit object would be E and put objects back would be Q. I assume. If I could go back, that would be great. There we go. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? I'm not trying to leave the area in the first place. Is there a pause button? Hang on a second. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and see if the PS4, if the PS4 controller works. Second, I, I'll be right back. <laughs> oh God, everything's going horribly wrong. <sighs> okay. I'm not gonna put on my headphones again real quick because I I gotta figure this shit out. Okay. Does this work? It's also not working. Fuck. Alright, well that sucks. How do I how am I able to save though? I don't Like, I need to get to the pause menu so I can save here, and then I can, like... And then I can, like, come back to this area so that I can... Fucking... <sighs> this sucks. This actually sucks. Well, it's, just, it's not bad. It's just normally... I... <laughs> ah! Lord, have mercy. Shit, Zed. That is not... 
it looks more like a smart board. Black Quarter is also LCD screen every day, yada yada yada. You should fully investigate. I'm trying to find the pause button, game. No! I'm trying to find the pause button! Where's the. Oh, enters the investigative power. Okay. But where's the pause button? I'm pressing every damn button here. It's not working. Where's the pause button? Take a screenshot of something. This is this is a nightmare. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm really so I might have I might actually have to exit the game and all right, fuck it, fine. Yeah, cool, thank you, I've asked. Really hoping that didn't do anything to my stream. Check. Doesn't appear to be. All right, watch the configuration tool. Uh, full screen, window, anti-help type, keyboard, and mouse. What the fuck? What's the difference between keyboard and mouse and this and keyboard and mouse that? Alright, Google to the rescue! This is a nightmare. This is a goddamn nightmare. What is... The difference between <laughs> RTY. Yes, this is <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm trying my best here, but this is Hey, Davis. Oh, is that really it? Okay, that's it. Okay. Yep, yeah, I'm an idiot. All right, keyboard and mouse. We're good. Start game. For the love of God, start in full screen, please. Please start in full screen. Don't make me use the alt enter thing again. I'm begging you. Please. Please, 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 please. I'm begging you. Oh my God, this is a nightmare. <sighs> Thank you. Yes, 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 yes. We get it, we get it, we get it, we get it, we get it. Yes, cool. There's no way it would have saved my, my game. It didn't. All right. New game. I don't have the demo version. Do it in English. <clears throat> Everything on normal. We've done this before. All right. I don't think there's a way to skip this because I'm pressing every goddamn button and nothing is happening, so... Y'all just have fun watching that. I'm gonna go. It's uh, y'all have fun. I can't. I'm really hoping y'all can't hear the the uh, heater in the background, because my god. <clears throat> yeah, we know, the story's not over. Can I please skip this? We've been through this already! Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I know. I'm aware. Shut the fuck up. Oh my 
god. Yeah, nothing. Yeah, we, we've been to this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are Ka Kaede, Kaede. How do you pronounce it again? This is me. My name is Kaede Akamatsu. Kaede Akamatsu. Kaede Akamatsu. Write that down, people. I just missed. I'm the. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. We know, we know, we know, we know. Ultimate revi Revival. Yeah, we know. Slip on the floor, fill on the floor. You gotta leave a bump. Huh? A classroom? Yeah, classroom, alright, but you don't recognize it. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> the fucking sound effect, I swear to god, it's the best. Yes, yes, aware, fully aware. Hey, it's a boy! A normal looking boy! Yeah. Mm hmm. Game's processing again. Just give it a second to catch up, it'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, come on. Come on, man. We know. We know, man. Dude, come on. We don't have all day. Thank you. Huh? Um, wait. Hey. Yeah, 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 You, uh, okay. regular guy, school. Wonder why. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Let's try this again. Now let's go into basic controls. Uh, I'm gonna get my pamphlet out. Uh, don't mind the lack of rustling paper. Um, there we go. Use your mouse to control the reticle on the screen. When you have a target on your sights, just press left click to investigate it. Hold down right click and move the mouse to adjust your view. Wait. Hold down right click. You can just use WASD! There's a space bar that smacks objects around. Who knows? You might find something, might something amazing. You can always press the Q key to return objects to their original position, so relax. However, not every object can be moved. Thanks, thanks for your understanding. If you press the extra key, a mysterious investigative power will activate. Don't know why it couldn't be tabbed like every other Danganronpa game up until this point on a PC, but eh, I'm not the developer. I'm just the God. Sorry, I know this is a lot of information. Investigate this place thoroughly. That's how you progress the story, you know. You should fully investigate the area first. Oh, thank God. All right, we're back on track. We're back on track. All right, let's try this again. The outside window is covered in greenery and barbed wire? Why are the school windows covered in barbed wires? Well, it makes more sense than metal place, that's for sure. Oh, that is so much cleaner. In the original games, it used to be just like circles that were, uh... That would like highlight certain objects, but this... This is way better. Like, it makes things so much more clear on what you can interact with or not. You welcome inside these lockers. <clears throat> but why were we in these lockers in the first place? Dunno. That's a blackboard, right? Every classroom has one, but this blackboard is also an LCD screen. That's something you don't see every day. Yeah, even in modern times, like smart boards and whatnot, like those things were usually just whiteboards, just with, with like, um, calibrations. It's like, it's like a drawing tablet, but you have to project the screen onto it and calibrate it. It's just wonky. God, that's cool! <laughs> Did you see the way that desk just just flew away? Oh my 
god, that's amazing. <laughs> oh my god, I have, I have the powers of a goddess. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm getting mono coins by fucking up the area. Oh my god. I love this game. <laughs> oh, I love this. Alright. That's the entire room cleared. Was it worth it? Probably not. Let's just... There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> is this a monitor? Nothing's being displayed right now. Seriously though, what is this? It's, it really seems out of place here. Oh my god, this game is amazing. <laughs> Where am I? Why was I kidnapped? Who kidnapped me? I don't know. Oh, god damn it. <clears throat> Game's frozen again. Well, I mean, it's not frozen. Everything else is like... It's like the game, like, paused itself to process everything. And I don't know what's causing that. Oh my god, it's still... <laughs> Goodness. All right, give it a second to buffer. There we go. I don't understand this at all. But that doesn't matter. At least for now. Hey, let's just get out of here as fast as we can, can and find some help. Uh, okay. Yeah, good idea. We ran as fast as we could to the classroom door and opened it with all our strength. Then... What the fuck? Hell yeah! Found you! What the hell? What? A, a monster? <laughs> this is bad. We need to get out of here. This looks like... What was that Pokemon with all the, the, the metal and the bars? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait! What? What do you want? Katie, over here! I'm going as fast as I can, man! Game! Oh my god, it's actually- Oh my god! That's terrifying! Holy shit! Oh my god! Uh, this way? What the actual fuck? What is happening? Oh my god, another one! <laughs> Don't go that way! Over here! I'm trying, man! I'm trying! Holy shit! This is... Oh my god, this is way more intense than the other games! Holy shit, what's going on?! Oh my god, another one. Uh, geez. What are those things? I don't know! Just go! Go, 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 go! Holy shit, what is happening?! What the fuck?! Oh god, what god. Just... The... Is it still following me? I guess not. Going! To the gym, I guess. As we frantically dove t towards the door, we saw something we never expected to see. Oh, more people have arrived. Huh? Um, hi? Did you all get chased by that monster too? Yeah, we did! Uh, oh, yeah. <clears throat> what are they? What do they want with us? I don't know, man. Do you want me to check on what's happening? You can't! It's too dangerous out there! It's likely that monster still lurks nearby. Likely? Dude... <laughs> Wait! I think it's more than just a little likely. I shut it at the top of my lungs. Who are you guys? <clears throat> and why am I here? And that makes 16. What? I'm talking about us. There are 16 of us. All high schoolers. What do you think that means? 
16 high schoolers? I know what it means. <clears throat> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh. Oh, right. Didn't answer your question. My name is Rantaro Amami. Nice to meet you. I'm sorry, but... Let's leave it at that for now. What? Um, uh... Okay. You know... Anyway, why does it matter if there are 16 of us? There might be more coming. No. Nah, I think this is all of us. If this is what I think it is, anyway. What? If this is what you think it is? Hey! What do you... What, you some kind of fucking know-it-all? If you know something, spit it out! Alright, well, you're a charmer. <clears throat> it was at that moment, an unknown voice suddenly echoed through the gym. Oh! Oh! I know who this is! Shut up! We'll get to you in a moment. Ah, fine! Okie dokie! Okay! Quiet, everyone! Shimmy down! Shimmy down! Oh, wait. Oh! Oh! These are my children! Wait, okay, no need to spoil it. No, no, no! It's Simmer Down! What? Huh? Who's, who's that? Where are they? Oh, God! <laughs> Thanks for bearing with us! Oh, oh, God, it froze. <laughs> it froze in the middle of the dialogue! What is this happening? Is this normal? I don't know what's going on. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Normally it's be a good time for me to talk to chat, but there is no chat, so... Oh, there we go! We're back! Are you serious? God damn it! There are more monsters! We're surrounded! These aren't monsters. They're ex exes. What the fuck? Exesels? And that's that. They're highly mobile bipedal weapon platforms. Weapons? Hell yeah! Should we take these for a spin by killing one of them? <laughs> <laughs> Why did I make you laugh? Yeah! Wait a minute! It wouldn't be any fun picking on plain old good for nothing commoners! <laughs> <laughs> You're right. We should at least think of an interesting way to kill you. Maybe I'll pick you up and squeeze you until your guts come gushing out like toothpaste. Wait. Please, not like toothpaste. Oh, I just imagined it. I can't handle well. gore. Then what if we start peeling off their limbs one by one by like string cheese? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Please, not string cheese either. Ah. Wait, we can't kill them with eggs, 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 eggs. Well, how the fuck do you pronounce this? According to the schedule, the eggs, eggs, easels aren't supposed to show up till later. What are you saying? But we're in the eggs, easels right now. Ah. So, oh, so we are. Oh. We screwed up. We're not supposed to be in the eggs, easels for our first appearance. I told you we should have read the script. What are you saying? Oh my god. No, you didn't. Well, why don't we just get out of these mechs? It shouldn't be too late for that. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. So. Okay, ready? Oh, God. And here they are, folks. The Mono Cubs. The Fane. Oh, God. <laughs> God damn it. Huh? Hey. See? We're out of the eggsy souls. Now, we're not scary anymore, right? 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 Aww. His desperation is strangely terrifying. You, you punk ass better brace yourselves! And he's just outright terrifying! That's right. I'm a messenger from hell for the depths of hell! Here to drag it down to hell! Hey. No, no, Mono Kid. You're saying hell too much. It's ruining the hellish impact. Hey. Eh, what does hellish mean? What? Hey, what's up with these stuffed animals? How are they moving? 
I have no idea. Moving stuffed animals. What did you sound like? I couldn't get a grasp on your voice. On top of that, it seems like they're calling themselves the Mono Cubs. Moving stuffed animals? Mono Cubs? <clears throat> oh, jeez. Wait! You guys call yourselves the Mono Cubs? Oh, don't bother asking Monodam. He only talks to close friends. Years of abuse have really done a number on his heart. Isn't that right, Monodam? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> what the fuck was that? What did that say? Monodam, you won't even open your heart to me? Looks like I was right. This is exactly what I thought it was. But who's behind all this? Why the th ridiculous theatrics? Shut up. Gah! Shut up, you! All oh, you are reacting way too normally to this. It's boring. <coughs> oh my god, that's hurting my throat. Actually, don't their clothes kind of look boring too? Hey. Wait a minute. You think maybe they haven't been given the first memory yet? Huh? What should have happened before they woke up? Hey, answer my question. If you guys are the Mono Cubs, then. Hey, who the hell are you punks? Huh? Huh? Ah, they're froze again. <sighs> oh my god, the fucking voice ranges. Not exactly the best thing to be doing when, you, when I'm doing voice training. At least I don't think. Is it? I don't know. I'm not an expert on this shit. <laughs> Yeah, amazing adventure. Pars for the core story. Actually, not par for the core story. Is... What do you mean? What? We were wondering who, who you guys have ultimate talents or anything like that. Uh, sorry, we were wondering, do you guys have ultimate talents or anything like that? Ultimate talents? No. I don't have one. I have a skill that I devote myself to, but I wouldn't call it an ultimate talent. Uh, me neither. I don't have anything like that. Yeah, same here. I knew it! They haven't gotten their first memory yet! Monofani, weren't you in charge of that? She's sleeping? It's... Did she seem tired to you guys? She's obviously faking it! Even if she's faking it, she looks so peaceful. Let's whisper so we don't wake her up. <laughs> if you say so. Um, anyways, if you guys really are the Monocubs, then... Don't worry about us. The real issue is you bastards. Well, issue was putting it mildly. This is actually a huge problem. You was all we've forgotten your talents and become generic high school students. Huh? huh? Forgotten? You see, according to the backstory, there's the ultimate hunt going on. You've all lost your memories and become different people because of the ultimate hunt. Ah, I'm starting to sound like my father. Um, what are you talking about? Well, if you're in current state, it's pretty much pointless to talk to you guys about it. The first thing we need you guys to do is remember your true selves. Yeah, you need to reclaim your sealed talents by regaining your memories. What the? Are you awake already? I don't get it. What are these sealed talents you're talking about? How are we supposed to talk when you keep asking so many friggin' questions? Yeah, we're not some swift-footed singers who's landed another future ex-boyfriend. Oh well. Right now. Let's just do this already. No one wants to watch a bunch of generic high school whose line is. First, we'll update your wardrobe so you guys look all cute and spiffy. What the fuck? Oh. Uh, the fuck? Oh my god! <laughs> is that gonna get me banned? I mean, I know it looks like a Barbie doll, but is this gonna get me? Is this gonna affect me? I got it. Am I gonna? Oh god damn it! I feel like an idiot. What the fuck is happening? Now they actually look like Dondoro, but characters. Huh? 
What am I wearing? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks good. Now you look more like ultimates. Huh? Ultimates? Really? So... Next up, the memory you has all been waiting for. Hell yeah. Hell yeah! Get ready! Once the seal is broken, we'll be in the domain of the killing game! Killing game? Alright! Now then, after the flashback lights, I hope you remember your amazing talents. This amazing story will begin for real this time! So long, uh, thanks! Um... What the fuck? Um, I suppose, why not, right? <laughs> sure, yeah, let's save. What the fuck is happening? <clears throat> Ultimate revival again. I'm sorry, what the fuck? Huh? What's happening? I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. I couldn't even brace for impact as blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. And it froze again. <clears throat> this is literally the same theme as, bef as before. What is happening? I'm, I have a feeling this is going to be a common theme with this game. Oh boy. Ow! But thanks to that pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Huh? huh? Wait, where am I? What is this place? I rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely going to leave a bump. This is the same. A classroom? Kaede. <clears throat> Yeah, that's the classroom, all right? What am I doing here? Why is your voice so quiet? Is this supposed to be that uh, quiet? Oh, this is a dream? I just have to pinch myself, right? Hold on. <laughs> Christ. But all I did was to make her head hurt in two places instead of one. Um, <clears throat> um, okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end I just couldn't... Oh boy. Suddenly the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noise. As, fear f as I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened up and... I've been making the same reading mistakes, God damn it! A boy came stumbling out. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student too. No shit. He looked up, he looked bewildered and when he slowly lifted his head. <clears throat> ah, ah! How rude! Don't freak me out like some sort of monster! Uh, sorry. I I'm sorry too, okay? I just have no idea what's going on. Yeah. But all the more reason why we need to stay calm. Oh, what the f Fuck? Oh, Gymno PD e number one by Eric Sate. Yeah, that's right. Try to imagine that sorrowful melody filling your head and soothing your heart. That <clears throat> scared the fuck out of me. What the fuck is happening? Huh? A teddy bear? Oh, no, no, it's a monster. You can freak out. You can freak out about this. I don't think she's talking about you. That's so mean. You humans are the real monsters for calling us monsters. Although, if we are monsters, at least we're pretty monsters. I agree. I'm glad I was born with these looks. I definitely won the genetic lottery. Huh? What are they? Why are they talking? Aren't they just stuffed animals? We're not. We're not model cows for this. <laughs> We're the stuffed animals! Why was I given the stupid trait? Psst, Mono Kid, you're saying your lines backwards. No stuffed animals, us! 
<laughs> the motto comes then! Yeah. Oh, jeez, even worse now. Huh? Mono cubs? Oh, you've heard of us. Oh, no, of course not. I've never seen any walking, talking stuffed animals. As soon as I said that, these mono cub things started looking at each other and... Yay, Yay it worked! You had me worried there for a second. Right now, you're on the hey, of amazing worried about what? I don't understand what's going on. Okay. All right, let's tackle each issue one at a time. You're so damn reliable, Monotaro! Hey, he's, he's like a sixth grader helping out a fifth grader. Hey. Which means we should keep our expectations reasonable. Um, well, what's your question? I have loads of questions, but for starters, where are we? This looks like a school. Okay, so this place is called the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles? That's what I said. Ultimate Academy? I never heard of a school like that. That's right. Of course you haven't. This school was made for you, 16 Cretans. What? 16? That's right. Yeah, and there are 16 ultimates at this school. Huh? Ultimates? Well, <clears throat> you know what you know what ultimates are, right? The government scouts them through this program called the Ultimate Initiative. Actually, ultimate basically means you're you're particularly prod prodigious and a particular talent. <gasps> Basically, the ultimate initiative exists. To oh god damn it. Hang on, the game froze again. <sighs> so, uh, any of you guys like rock music? I haven't fall Wait, I haven't <sighs> God damn it. I don't talk well without a script. I'm particularly into kiss myself. They're goddamn amazing! You ever listen to their music? Goddamn legends in the punk fields. Oh, there we go. Basically, the ultimate initiative exists to cultivate talent throughout the country. Promising students are eligible to receive all kinds of special hangouts. Stuff. Like free school tuition, voting privileges, eligibility to run for election office. They get, they get grant money too, right? That's right. Students chosen by the ultimate initiative are known as ultimates. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Students would do anything for the honor of being a chosen ultimate. Mm, excuse me. I don't need the explanation. I already know. Because I'm an ultimate too. That means you gotta remember this time, so don't forget anymore. Yeah, forgetting about your ultimate talent is such a waste. Huh? What do you mean forgetting? Shut up! Shut up! Quit your yapping and get started already! Huh? Get started with what? By exploring this academy, of course. Also, you should introduce yourselves to the this ultimates. Because you guys are all going to do an activity together later. Awesome! I'm going to rage you right now. I'm sorry, what the fuck? Uh, moving on. Well then. So long, farewell. They pull off the, the puns better than Monokuma himself. Uh, they left! But I still have so many questions. Hey. This is, isn't a dream, right? No, but I wish it was. <clears throat> Not the best thing for me to do when I'm trying to sell more feminine. Anyway, we have to find a way out of here. But they said there are 16 ultimate students here. Does that mean he's one too? I suppose so. Unless he's just the ultimate lucky student. Hey. Um, are you an ultimate student too? Uh, okay. Yeah, well, well I'm then. Shuichi Saihara. They call me the ultimate detective, but... Alright, I gotta figure out how to make the voices louder, because for some reason, whenever, like, there's any lines with voice acting, it's really damn quiet, and I don't know why. <clears throat> what? You're a detective? That's amazing! No. Uh, no. I don't have the credentials to call myself a detective yet. I just happened to solve a case that I came across, and now people call me that. No. How many people can just happen to solve a case? You should be more proud of that. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> My name is Kaede Akamatsu. I'm the ultimate pianist. Nice to meet you. That would explain the clip I saw. <laughs> ultimate pianist? Yeah. Well, no one calls me the ultimate pianist. Usually just piano freak. <laughs> Ever since 
Since I was a child, I would play the piano whenever I got bored. There were even times I played the piano so much that I would forget to eat and sleep. Eventually, I won trophies from concerts, and people started praising me. That's how you got your ultimate title? And that's way more impressive than me. Dude, come on. Don't, don't downplay yourself. No, that's all I'm good for, really. <clears throat> but this is my first time meeting another ultimate student. Yeah. Well, ultimates are scattered all over the country. They're difficult to find. Um, Even so, there are 16 ultimate students gathered here now. But why is everyone here? Were they kidnapped? Mm. If so, then... And is some organization out here trying to kidnap all the ultimates? Hey. Uh, about that. I don't remember. Huh? huh? You don't remember? Uh, um... I've been trying to remember it, but I can't. No matter how hard I try, I have no idea how I got here. When I woke up, I was in that locker. I don't know how I got here. It's like that memory just fell out of my head. Same here! <clears throat> huh? You know? I can't remember anything. Even though I'm trying so hard to remember. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> what happened? Are you okay? What's wrong? No. Oh, I'm fine. I just got a headache. That's all. But... It can't be a coincidence that we both don't remember. What happened to us? Um, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Probably not a big deal. Uh, froze again. Don't mind me, just scrolling through Discord while I wait for the game to catch up. It's gonna be a while, isn't it? Oh, wait, 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 wait! <clears throat> right? We're confused. Let's just, need, we just need to relax is all. Oh, let's imagine Maurice's Ravel's, I don't know how to pronounce that. God damn it. That's... Is this that music? Uh, I don't really know much about music. I see. I see. That's unfortunate. When we get out of here, I'll share it with you. All right. But first, let's look for a way out. Oh, goodness. And if there are other Ultimate students here, we should talk to them, too. And at least one of them has got to know something. Right. Yeah, good idea. Friendship Fragment. Ooh, damn. So instead of Hope Crystals or Fragments, it's Friendship Fragments. <clears throat> you can leave a room by pressing the Escape Key or interacting with the door. Apparently, you can also press the R key, but eh, whatever. <clears throat> All right, dude, this game is looks so good. Even though it's a hallway, there's sure a lot of plants going around here. The air here is heavy, impressively heavy, as if forcing you to recall your fears, smothering you in anxiety. But this is just a school, right? What kind of school makes you feel like this? And that's one of the things that drew me into this game, is the overgrown aesthetic to the school. I don't know why, but I always love this kind of aesthetic. It just looks neat. It's like with Portal 2 in the beginning, where all the test chambers are overgrown as nature takes over because Gladys is fucking dead. You can't really keep, uh, <clears throat> keep them all pristine. It just feels nice for some reason. Huh? What's the matter? What's the matter? I just felt something in the pocket of my uniform when I looked. When I looked... Oh, come on. <sighs> really? What's wrong? The game's frozen again. Oh, come on! There, there we go. I found this inside. It's some kind of mini tablet computer. Uh, oh, maybe I have one too! I knew my backpack felt heavier. Um. The word monopad is written on it. When did this get in my backpack? My name was displayed when it booted up, like a student handbook. I don't know what it could be used for, but I don't think we could throw it away. It just... let's just... hold on to them for now. Yeah, yeah I agree. <clears throat> Congratulations! You can now use the monopad! 
press the F key to open the monopad. It's got tons of game information in it. Stuff like the report card and map. But be sure to check it out. And if you got a sharp eye, you may have already noticed, by getting closer to your fellow students, your report card will be updating with content. You guys like content in the modern age, right? I'm always hearing about content creators making it big on your job getting trailed off. Since you are now acquaintances with Miss... To Saihara, his information has already been added. And I bet you also already noticed that you can level up by performing actions. You're already level two. I'm so proud. We level up your skill shots and cre <clears throat> Sorry. When you level up your s level up, your skill slots increase, so you can equip even more skills. There are a lot of skills, so few of them in the reward card. If you want skills, make friends, strengthen your bonds. Be sure to test out all the skills! Also, there's one more important thing to tell you. You can save and load the game from the handbook! Make sure you save all the important stuff! You know, like when the game has gamepad and controls instead of keyboard controls, and you have to restart the entire intro all over again without a skip button. Yeah, that's right, Chunsaj, I'm calling you out! I may be one of your mascots, but even I know when to call you out for your bullshit! Ahem! <clears throat> oh, well then, off you go! Mates. I'm already on that, don't worry. Dude, this is so cool! Oh, and it froze again. <gasps> Alright. Why does it do this? Is this normal? Do I have to restart the game again just to get this to stop? I gotta figure out what's going on here, because this is starting to get on my nerves. Alright. I'm pressing the F key and nothing's happening. Oh, F1. Review the layer of the academy. This will help you find specific locations. Review evidence. Oh, wait, these are just explanations for what's going on here. Kaede Akamatsu. Cool. And Suichi Saihara. The two protagonists. Listen, they're both front and center on the on the art for this game, so it makes sense. Locked. It won't open. Let's just look somewhere else. Okay. Alright. Ooh, what's that? Wait a minute! Is this a music room? Huh? Uh, it won't open. But this room looks like it was made for me. Oh God damn it! Oh, they're, they're here again. What do you think of this place? What do you think this place is? Check out all this fancy schmancy writing! <laughs> oh my God! <clears throat> Seems like a place for eggheads. Huh? Isn't this an ultimate research lab? You stupid. What the hell? Why would you tell them? We were trying to make it all dramatic. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. Huh? Huh? Well, what's an ultimate research lab? Yay! We want you guys to keep honing your ultimate talents. So we set up these rooms for you. This is the ultimate pianist lab. But we set up labs for the ult their ultimates too, of course. Well, actually, Most of them are still hidden though. By the way, the reason this research lab is still locked is... Is? Because we're still setting up everything. Sorry, we'll hustle to get it all ready. Wipe your asses and wait! <laughs> the hell you saying? That's good advice and all, but don't you mean say hold your horses? <laughs> Mana Kid is such a dummy. What are you laughing at? I'll bully you like I bully Mono Down! Get out of here, you stupid kids. <clears throat> it seems like the music room, but I guess it's an ultimate lab. Hey. Do you think there are other rooms like this for everyone? Hmm. I wondered about that too. Anyway, I thought this was the music room. Uh, I really wanted to play the piano. <sighs> oh well, I can play as much piano as I want when I finally escape this place. Very true. 
Oh god damn it, I'm I'm all quiet on the mic. For fuck's sake. I love how it feels like you have more camera control. Oh hi. I love how you have slightly more camera control than in the other games. In the other games, you just have left and right um, movement. You couldn't look up or down at all, but this, this feels so cool. I love this. <clears throat> Hello. Um, hey, you're an ultimate student, right? Can we talk? Um, hmm? did she not hear me? Okay, then. Hey, hello. Uh, um... Huh? What? She still can't hear me? Maybe she's a really detailed mannequin? No. No, I don't think that's the case. No. You never know. You already saw a moving teddy bear. As I said that, I poked her cheek <laughs> and felt her skin squish me with my fingertip. Uh, huh? Poking her doesn't work either. And maybe she's just a doll? But she looks so real. Try it, Suichi. Poke, poke! Huh? Uh, no thanks. Just do it! It's so fun! As I grabbed his hand to make a poker punch. <laughs> Come on! I never thought I'd be poked from both sides. How truly unexpected! Ah! So she wasn't the mannequin. Well, I knew that. Wait! If you knew that, why did you make me poke her? Because she wasn't responding. No. Oh, I didn't mean any harm. I was just deep in thought. So I thought if I ignored you, you'd go somewhere else. You were ignoring us? Isn't that a bit rude? What? Um, well, isn't it a bit rude to force someone to talk when they don't want to? God damn it, the game. How do I? <sighs> okay, this isn't terrible, but it is a bit of a pace breaker. Especially when you're trying to stream the game. Come on. This is gonna be a pain in the ass. There we go. Oh, but it's fine. I feel like talking now. Right. Now let's talk. What do you want to start with? Right, My favorite Doraemon episode is fit number 53. The one with security cameras and target practice. You know? Um, before you talk about that, can you tell us your name? Huh. My name is Sumogi Shirogane. I'm the ultimate cosplayer. Well, that's cool. So, you're a cosplayer? Are you surprised? I get that a lot since I'm so plain. I mean, it sort of makes sense. You have this strange, almost sexy aura about you. Why would they make me say that? I bet it's because you got all these people ogling all your curves on a daily basis, huh? Okay, no. No, this is... this, this is um. weird. Kaimeda, you sound like a creepy old man. Normally, I don't really like people looking at me like that. Actually, I just like making cosplay. I find I'm fine with others wearing them. But, but lately, more cosplayers are putting themselves before their characters. You're right. I'd rather wear my outfits myself with love than give them to people like that. Mm. Wow, you're pretty intense. Oh. <clears throat> it makes me feel happy when I get to show people the outfits I made. I'm probably gonna have to find a way to get more varied. Um, voices for all the girl characters. <laughs> and thanks to my sponsors, I can use materials that are just plain expensive. Oh, well of course the ultimate cosplayer would have sponsors. Yeah. It's not a big deal. People just crowd around like I'm a panda at a zoo. That's so amazing! You're pretty much a celebrity, you know? Hey. Uh, is that alright if I ask you something too? Really, you looked as if you were thinking hard about something. What was it? Yeah, that's right. Oh yeah! We need to ask her that. Nice job, Suichi. It's from that one thing. Ah, that bronze dragon statue over there. I'm just plain curious about it. Um. It almost seems like it's floating, right? Doesn't it look pretty out of place? Yeah. Now that you mention it, you're right. It sort of bothers me, too. Um. This is a school, right? But everything here is so weird, isn't it? There's trees and grass growing inside. I can't find any exits, and it seems like we're the only people here. Actually. Are we going to be okay? Are you going to be able to get out? Um. Kamaida, what's wrong? 
That <laughs> fine look on her face was sort of s Kaida, come on! <laughs> this again? I'm just kidding. Well, it's not a big deal. Our present situation is our main concern. Once it's over, well, I'll be good and dandy. You're pretty optimistic, Kaida. Well, people do say I'm carefree. Yeah, that's right. Worrying about worrying won't get you anywhere, you know? It's better just to be carefree. Yeah. I feel that on a certain level, honestly. Yeah, I guess so. Being all depressed won't help anything. Yeah. yeah, so let's try and find a way out. God, I really gotta find a way to distinct the, the other girl characters. God damn it. Ah, another friendship fragment. Sumugi's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Okay, cool. <clears throat> well, this looks garish. This kind of reminds me of the... Um... The fun house in the second game. You know that one? Where can I find other students? Hello? Anyone? Anyone at all? I leveled up just by walking. Holy shit. Oh my god, look at my XP bar! <laughs> I just grind by just doing, just walking around. It's cool. What's with this? What's with this caged off area? Let me check to see if there's a way you can change the the options. Ah, there we go. Mm, it froze again. All right, give it a sec. It's gonna be a while. Invert, invert x-axis, text speed, voice volume! There's the voice volume! Hopefully this will be a little better. I don't know how much better it will be, but I mean, it's worth a shot, right? Okay, so there's the rest, the other... How high up are we? Hello? Anyone else in here? Ooh! Two students! Hey! Hey! Wait for me! Please stop! Please stop! Don't come any closer! That boy in the white is chasing that other boy in the funny clothes. What's happening here? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Boom, 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 bitch! I am the guys of destruction! <laughs> oh, god damn it. Alright. Come on. I don't have all day. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to smack you. I was trying to smack the, uh, this. There we go. Come on. Don't mind me, boys. Just trying to find some spare change. You know how it is. Especially in this economy. Hey, uh, sir, can you move out of the way? I don't want to accidentally smack you while I'm looking for, for coins. I guess I gotta do this. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. And... Ooh, what's that? Can I smack that? Hmm. Actually, let me test something real quick. Options. Map controls! Shooter... Or Danganronpa. What's the difference between shooter and Danganronpa? Map displays, voice language, restore defaults. What's the difference between Danganronpa and... What? Oh boy. Transcript, controls, radical... Okay. What did that do, though? I'm just going to get back to Shooter, because I don't know. There we go. Anyways, moving on. 
friend of mine really likes you. Please stop! <clears throat> Please stop! Don't come any closer! <laughs> come on! Wait up! Let me touch your body a little. Always wanted to be friends with a robot. Okay. Context, dude. Huh? What? A robot? What is, it? what is it? Are you another robophobe? I have a recording function. If you make any robophobic remarks, I will see you in court. Hey. Wait, you're a robot? Are you for real a robot? No. Are you one of the mono cubs? Stop. Don't do not compare me to those toys. I am not just any old robot. I am K1B0, the ultimate robot. But please address me as Kibo. That is an oddly adorable name. Kibo, the ultimate robot. Um. Ultimate robot? And it froze again. God damn it. Oh shit, hang on. Hang on, 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 hang on. Just hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything. Just give me, give me, give me a second, give me a second. Give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. Don't do anything, 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 don't do anything. Don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything. Don't do anything, don't do anything. Don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything. Don't do anything, 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 don't do anything. Okay, we're back. Just um give the game a second to catch up real quick. Any minute now. I... Blow. Oh, oh, am I back? Hmm. There we go. That's not fair. You can't be the only one who gets to show off. I'll introduce myself too. Yeah. Um, go ahead. I'm Kokichioma, the ultimate supreme leader. Supreme. That sounds like an overlord name or su uh, super villain name. A robot and a supreme leader? Neither of them make any sense. By the way, <clears throat> By the way I learned the hard way that robots' breath smells like gasoline. Oh, My breath does not smell like gasoline. I am powered by electricity. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. That is not funny. You're not funny. Right? Of course you don't think I'm funny. Robots can understand human humor to begin with. Do not mock Do me. Not, don't mock me. I have studied the complete history of stand-up comedy. I think you should have just watched stand-up comedy instead of studying it. Um. Plus, I may have the appearance of a robot, but I am a high school student just like you. Huh? You're a high school student? Yeah. I was created by Professor I Iba Ida... Give me a second. Idabashi. By Professor Idabashi, the leading authority in the field of robotics. He installed in me a strong AI, capable of learning and maturing like a human brain. That's why, at the time of my creation, I didn't know anything. I was like a baby. But, but the professor raised me like I was his own child. He taught me so many things, until finally he enrolled me in high school. Well, he's a better creator than frickin' Frankenstein. That bastard threw out his, ran away from his own child the minute he was able to fucking breathe. How about this? And now I stand before you all. See? I'm just like everyone else. Hey! Hey, do robots have. <laughs> what the fuck? Kokichi! Hey. Please don't ask ridiculous questions. <laughs> <laughs> I only ask because your backstory is pretty flaccid for a robot. Okay, fuck you. Like, just fuck you. Well, I can see how being a robot might be enough to be called the ultimate robot. Hey, Kokichi, I didn't. I don't really understand your ultimate supreme leader talent. Ah, I'm just the supreme leader of an evil secret organization. That's all. I knew it! You're a villain! You're a secret villain! Huh? What? Um... I gotta say, it's pretty impressive. My organization has over 10,000 members. Huh? Seriously? The supreme leader of an evil secret organization? Because I'm a liar. Who knows? 
I am a liar after all. Huh? Huh? So you were lying just now. It's true. Oh, I am the Spoon Leaper and Evil e Secret Organization. That part was true. Jeez. So were you lying or not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not telling you. Hey. Uh, by the way, what is the name of that organization? Uh. It's a secret. You know, because it's a secret organization. But I've never heard of such a large secret organization like that. Maybe. Of course you haven't, because it's a secret organization. Nice. Hey, everything he said so far has sounded like a lie. So that's got to be a lie too. Oh, just leave him be. Oh, just leave him alone. Everything he has been saying has been a lie. He's a far more suspicious person than I am. That's for sure. <laughs> well, of course you're not a suspicious person, because robots aren't people, silly. Can I punch him in the face? <laughs> oh, you mad? Are you gonna hit me with a rocket punch? I don't have that function. Ah oh, man, you're boring. What a weird boy. He's like a mischievous little kid. It's... This is no time to be joking around. Unless he really is an evil supreme leader. Kokichi and Kibo's report cards have been updated based on your experiences with them. Nice. If you're rude to the good boy again, I will kill you next. Anyways. Anything I can interact with here? It's a bit weird having to move from the WASD to the entry key because I'm so used to it being tab to to show the uh this shit. So that's gotta be a bit weird to get used to. Normal schools don't have monitors like this, right? Nope, definitely not. <clears throat> and it froze again. What is with this? Jesus Christ. <sighs> Alright, it's gonna take a minute, so just give it a minute. We'll be fine. Eventually, I swear to God. <clears throat> I'm really hoping there's nothing else I missed while I was exploring the area. Let me go back and see if there's any, um... Oh my God. There we go. Maybe there's someone in the restrooms? This is the girl's bathroom, right? Suichi, you don't mind waiting here. Uh, okay. uh um, you sure? Jeez. Don't give me that weird look. I'm just gonna check and see if there's anything inside. I doubt there'd be an exit, but just Sorry. in case. Sorry. Well then. Um. The toilets seem normal, but it's weird that the plants are growing this thick. Indeed. Boosh, 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 boosh! Oh, I love this. Let's see. Nothing I can investigate here. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, about the boys' bathroom. This is the boys' bathroom, right? I can't go in there. Not even in this situation. Really? Um, uh, if you want, I could go look. Huh? What? I'm not that curious about what's in there. Remember. Well, this is an unusual building. Anything could be in there. Wait here a minute. With that, Switch, you open the door and walk inside. Hmm. Here's a normal bathroom. Nothing out of the ordinary. No one was inside. I see. I see. That scared me. Maybe detectives live for these kind of scary situations. Perhaps, perhaps not. I don't know. God, the layout here is so... So different compared to... Oh! Hi? Hello? Hey. Oh, hey there. You guys get kidnapped too? Oh, you both look alright. That's good. Yeah. Situation could be better though. Yeah, yeah totally. Hey. hey, let me ask you something. Do you guys remember how you got here? If you're asking us, then 
You don't remember either, do you? <laughs> You're the same too, huh? You don't remember anything, do you? I guess that means everyone here is the same. Huh? huh? Everyone? I asked the others too. They all said they don't remember. So the others don't remember either. Froze again! What is- This better be- This better be something I get fixed by the time I get to the next stream. I swear to god. Excuse me. Alright. There we go. It's like, we all have amnesia or something. Ah, but that's not normal. If everyone here has amnesia, well, I guess we all live in pretty- You have a normal situation here, then. What the fuck? Huh? What? That's not true. Wait, amnesia's a stretch. We're probably just confused. I'm sure we'll remember eventually. No. Or could it be group hypnosis? Maybe brainwashing? Why are you being so ominous, dude? <laughs> in any case, I hope you remember soon. That's a shame. Otherwise, I'll end up the outcast. Mm. The outcast? What do you mean? How should I put this? To tell you the truth, how I got here isn't the only thing I don't remember. I also forgot my own talent. What? You got me. Phew, I'm in trouble. I know it must have been some sort of ultimate. I just don't remember. Is that true? Of course it is. But then again, I don't blame you for not believing me. Oh. oh, I never told you my name, did I? It's not like I already told you, but then I forgot. I did, yeah. right? <clears throat> no, you haven't told me your name yet. My name is Rantaro Mami. Rantaro Mami. Moving on. Come on. Don't have all day. I can't remember my own It's still really quiet. Why is it so that quiet? Not bad. Nice to meet you. The ultimate. Nope. Yeah, we'll go with that. <clears throat> for some reason, for someone who can't remember his talent, he doesn't seem too shaken up about it. Actually. Is that weird? That I'm not really bothered by the fact that I don't remember my talent? Huh? What? Looking forward to it. You know, I actually kind of look forward to finding out. I wonder what ultimate I am. <laughs> anyway, it'd be nice if we could get along. We aren't going anywhere for a while. Please. Stop that! We'll escape soon! You really think it's going to be that easy? Huh? <clears throat> huh? What do you mean? No. Nothing. Nothing. Just a feeling. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Don't worry about it. It's all right. I thought he would be a pretty chill guy to talk to, but I have no idea what's going through his head right now. Friendship fragment. I guess it was a good idea to look around just in case. Ooh, school store. I guess this doesn't open. Let's look somewhere else. You're right. Okay. All right. Ooh, dining hall. Is this a dining hall? Dining hall definitely makes this place feel more like a school. But this place is called the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. I doubt it's anything like a typical school. It does look nice, though. Very overgrown, but nice. Hi. Huh? I'm yelling so I can build up my spirit energy! Don't you... Don't you know you can unlock your brain's full potential by yelling to build up a spirit energy? What the hell is this? Dragon Ball Z? Uh, I've never heard that pro athletes do that. <clears throat> I've heard that pro athletes do that. It's supposed to help you focus. Yes! I must be prepared for combat at all times, just in case someone tries to attack me! I will protect myself with Neo Ico Keto. I don't know. 
Aikido, then you're... Oh, yes! I'm Tango Shabashira! Yeah, The ultimate Aikido master! Oh, cool. What the hell is Aikido? Oh! I always imagined Aikido masters to be huge, burly guys, but you're so cute! You cute? Uh, stop it! I'm not very cute. And it froze again. It froze again. Alright, come on. You got a schedule to keep here. There we go. My face crinkles when I, when I suck down a shake and when I bite my face, my eyelids turn inside out. Um, I see. But I think you're cute. Right, Suichi? Uh, okay. Huh? Oh, right. <laughs> what the fuck? It froze again on that face! What the hell? Oh my god, this game. <laughs> I gotta mean who did the art for this, cause my fucking god. <sighs> okay, come on. <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god, this is stupid. <laughs> come on. Huh? There we go. What's the matter? Your face looks really intense now. I don't like being praised by degenerate male. Oh god damn it. Really? Degenerate males? You mean men? Are you uncomfortable around them? Yes. It's all—it's a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable. If a degenerate tries to touch me, my reflexes are grounded and thumb across the room. This is starting to become really irritating. So you're basically going to be the my hero of this, just instead of a photographer, you're a fighter. My god. Yeah. You're right. That is a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable around men. Are you serious? You cannot be fucking serious. Before it was like cute bigger gaps between each each time it froze. What is going on? Oh my god, this sucks. Hey. Uh, by the way, what's this Neo Aikido you mentioned? That's right. Neo Aikido is an original form of Aikido that my master and I completely made up ourselves. So your Aikido is all self-taught. Oh, thank God. Moving on. Hello. Yeah. So are we stuck here? Yeah, that's what it looks like. But don't be scared. I'm sure we'll be out of this place in a jiffy. No. I'm not scared. Just in pain. Something like this won't make me panic because I'm a mage. Huh? A mage? Hmm. hmm, that's right. I haven't told you guys yet. Prepare to be amazed. Fall to your knees. I am Himiko Yumeto, the ultimate mage. <laughs> she sounds so deadpan. I love it. But I'm officially called the ultimate magician. She kind of sounds like the mask kid from Ultra Despair Girls. <laughs> Oh, so you're a magician. You should have said that from the start. Mm. I mean, it makes sense, though. Since the magic doesn't exist. Uh. Yeah, magic does exist. Huh? Huh? Uh. Because I'm a mage. Um. You're just a magician, right? No. Only on paper. Okay. I'm known as a magician, but that's just a ruse. I'm actually a mage. Huh? Just a ruse? Uh. You guys... You guys might not know them, but there's a group called the Magic Castle. 
also known as the Hall of Magicians, it's where the world's magic lovers gather. I was the youngest person to ever win my Magician of the Year award. That's pretty cool. It's all a ruse. They're keeping my magic secret by disguising it as a tricks. Because of this ruse, I become famous all over the world for performing tricks. But I'm not a magician. I'm a mage. Nobody believes me. There, there. Don't be sad. Hey. Well, could you show us your magic? Then we can believe you. That's right. Oh, that's right. Help us out with your magic. Take us back when we originally. No. Magic isn't all powerful. I can only do so much. Mm. I see. And then what can you do? You're right. I can choose to cart the card you picked, pull out coins, and release doves. Yeah, if I get serious, I can even saw someone in half. Those are just ordinary magic tricks. Four card. Yep. Cool. Coolio. Got these two. All right. I'm gonna increase the volume. Of You cannot be fucking serious. Really? <sighs> Why? Why do you do this? Thank you. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright. <sighs> Moving on. This looks like the rules for the dining hall. Dining hall rules. Can we eat food? Can we eat any food you find in the dining hall? Please. <laughs> this is bullshit. This is actually bullshit. <sighs> Thank you. Please take responsibility for all utensils and dishes you use and clean up after yourselves. The dining hall will be locked during nighttime. Nighttime, so it's closed at night? And no shit. Yes, I'd like to leave. Hey buddy, how you doing? What's this? Warehouse. Anything in here? Anyone in here? Oh, it's that pink girl. Is this a warehouse? It's pretty big. <clears throat> Damn it! Damn it! Where the hell is it? We saw a conspicuous girl rummaging through a shelf filled with different chemicals. Hey. Hey, what are you looking for? Bitch. Don't sneak up on me, bitch! I literally just met you and you've already called me a bitch. Hey, hey, hey I'm sorry if we surprised you, but you shouldn't you talk to you shouldn't talk to Kaide like that. Hey! Hey, crotch rot! You're staring at my tits? Huh? What? <laughs> Help yourself! A guy like you can only dream of landing a big boot hottie like me. We got a lot of dipshits here in this cast. <sighs> Great. Come on, get yourself a good eyeful. Uh, um, no, I wasn't staring. My eyes just happened to look there. Oh, my eyes just happened to look there. Oh, my hand just happened to grope her. <laughs> I can identify pervs on sight, and you are definitely a fucking perv. That's why you wear that hat, right? To hide your skeevy eyes. You're gonna be the Hyoko of this game, aren't you? And that's why you wear those pants, right? To hide your nasty crotch. Everyone wears pants, though. <laughs> Everyone knows that only pervs wear hats. Stop it. Leave me alone! I can wear a hat if I want to! Ha! <laughs> Pushover prick. What the hell? Are you getting all pissed at off at me for? Because you're a bitch! Tell the world you're sorry! 
He startled me into losing motivation. That loss will be felt across the whole world. Hey. Hey, your vulgar language is uncalled for. Just who are you anyway? Huh? Seriously? You don't know who I am? No, I don't. And honestly, I kind of wish it stayed that way. Because I don't like you. I'm the gorgeous girl genius whose good looks and golden brain will go down in history. I'm the one, the only, the legendary ultimate inventor herself, Yui Ruma! <sighs> Great. Um, I've never heard of you. So what kind of things do you invent? <clears throat> I make all kinds of gadgets. One that let you type while you sleep, read while you sleep. Even ones that let you eat while you sleep. Why does everything involve sleeping? Sure. I was inspired after I realized how much time people waste on sleep. <laughs> Though this one in time I invented these really stupid eye drop contacts lens as a gag. Huh? Wait, really? That's your invention? Some of my friends wear them. <laughs> Psh, your friends like total plebs. That invention was nothing. Doesn't make you more productive while you sleep, so it was a failure, just like you two. I signed the patent rights over to some company and never looked back. It seems like such a waste. It's way better than your do stuff while sleeping inventions. I feel like these two have more sense than the other two protagonists, and more spine, which I can appreciate. Never let people talk down to you. And by the way, what are you looking? What were you looking for earlier? You sounded pretty desperate to find it. What was that? Eh, are you a dumbass? In a situation like this, I gotta find some meds! Huh? Medicine? Are you hurt or feeling sick? Fucking moron! No, idiot! I need strong meds because I want to tip trip my fucking balls off! Ah, uh, you're one of those. Ah! I just want to set my mind free and forget all this shitty situation. Oh, Wait, what? You can't just dr use drugs to get high? You de you definitely shouldn't do that. Stop it. No. Well, the game decided to stop it. Jesus Christ. Boy. So how y'all doing? Oh, oh, there we go. What the hell? My genius can't be constrained by the wisdom of the masses. Besides, this place probably doesn't even have the shit I need to get loosey-goosey. So, are we cool? Are you done being mad at me? <laughs> no. They say there's a fine line between genius and insanity, but she's definitely beyond insane. And also beyond dignity. Miu's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Your terrible, terrible experience with her. What's up, Suichi? <clears throat> He's been quiet over there since Miu mentioned his hat. Does he not like to talk about it? I can definitely appreciate these guys having more spine than the other um, protagonists of the series. Because, I'm gonna be honest, Makoto and, and uh, what was his name? Uh, Hajime, we're kind of doormats. I mean, let's be honest, for protagonists, it makes sense because you gotta meld with the other characters, but it's just, I don't know, it always seems so frustrating when, some, when someone, like, talks shit about them. Come on, dudes! You can speak up! You can do it! I believe in you. <clears throat> this looks like a high jump pole from track and field. I didn't expect to see professional equipment like this here. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's amazing. Anything else? Okay, bash her. No, god damn it. Oh well, it's fine. Oh, over there, over there, over there, over there. Oh my god, I love this game. <laughs> Alright, anyways, we're out of here. Hey, R Rintaro. What's your name again? Rintaro. Hey, Rintaro, how you doing?
There are stairs here. Looks like it goes down to the basement. Shuichi. What should we do, Suichi? You want to head down? Hmm. I don't know. The basement might be dangerous. This place is full of mysteries. That's right. And then let's proceed with caution. With you at the front. Okay. Ah, so I'm in front. I see. With hesitant Suichi leading the way, we carefully made our way down the stairs. Anyways. Um. It doesn't look very dangerous to me. Really? Ah, well, some dangers are hidden where you can't see. I see. Suichi, you have quite the imagination, don't you? No. No, I just think you're not considering how dangerous this is. <laughs> Yeah, maybe, but we should look around the basement, too. Right? There might be an exit. Oh, but we should be careful. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're right. This is creepy as all hell. Oh, and enters the map screen. That's cool. <clears throat> Anyone in here? Oh, hey! As soon as I opened the door, I suddenly gagged from the musty smell of books. Mm. Is this a library? You're right. There are books all over the place. Doesn't seem very organized. Uh. Oh, does that bother you? Are you a neat freak, Suichi? No. No, it's just I was wondering if someone was using it before us. Huh? huh? Someone? No. Ah, uh, it's nothing. Well, let's just investigate for now. Agreed. That's a pretty advanced looking globe. <clears throat> What a beautiful glow. <laughs> Bash the books! Suck learning! This is so stupid, I love it. This is so stupid, I hate it! <laughs> Come on! Why do you do this? Just... <clears throat> oh, God damn it! hang on. Any minute now. Any minute. There we go. All right. Back to bashing. Bash, 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 bash. Okay, I'm done. Um, what else is here? Suichi. Ooh, mystery girl. Hi. Hey. Um, are you an ultimate student too? Okay. Yeah, that's right. I got something on the side of my mouth. God damn it. Huh? Is that it? She sure doesn't talk much. Hi. I'm Kaede Akamutsu. I'm the ultimate pianist. I'm... I'm Suichi Sahari. Hara, and I'm the ultimate detective. I suppose. Please. She's not suppose. You are the ultimate detective, okay? Uh, okay. Yeah, you're you're right. Um, what about you? Maki Harukawa. Ultimate child caregiver. Huh. I see. Ultimate child caregiver, huh? <clears throat> Surprise. I don't like look like someone who, who like kids, do I? Huh? huh? That's right. Well, you'd be right. I don't like kids that much. Um, but, but you're the ultimate child caregiver, and children must like you a lot, right? I don't care. Kids are weird. They come to me on their own. I'm not that good at taking care of them. I'm not that friendly either. Mm -hmm. But they say kids are very intuitive. If they like you that much, hey. then they can probably tell how loving you really are, Mikey. Maki, not Mikey. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, that must be it. You've chosen a perfect career for yourself. Yeah. It wasn't my choice to begin with. Huh? Huh? What do you mean by that? So what? Nothing. It's just... I grew up in an orphanage and got saddled with helping out a lot. Orphanage, huh? I see. Um. Uh, by the way, do you know anything about monocubs? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, someone's got to be controlling them, right? Any idea who it might be? Like I'd know. How would I know? Hmm. Oh, fair point. Hmm. The monocubs are definitely involved in our situation. Mm -hmm. Hey, boy detective, shouldn't you already have figured out what's going on already? Huh? What? Um. Well, he's a detective, not a god. He can't know everything. Yeah. 
I mean, who cares about some stuffed animals? Escaping this place is way more important. Well... Seriously? You think we can escape? Abducting ultimates from across the country would require massive resources and planning. What makes you think a group capable of that would, be, would let us just walk out of here? That's not true. If they don't, don't let it... If they won't end this, then we will. We can do it if we work together. What? Work together? With strangers? You're a naive fool if you think you can end this so easily. Well, it's better than just sitting around moping. Like, do you have a better plan? And she's gone. <clears throat> Our conversation finished. She quickly headed out of the library. Hmm. That was kind of odd. She didn't seem like the ultimate child caregiver. Jeez. Please don't say that. Well, I mean, eh. Not everyone has to like kids. And to be honest, <clears throat> there are a lot of folks that are forced to take care of kids even when they don't want to, so it makes sense. Freaking game room? Dude, this looks cool. Huh? This looks like a game room. But this is a school, right? Is it normal for a school to have its own game room? Well. It certainly is strange. Who's the midget? What now? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, his fucking voice. Sheesh, what a strange place. But I heard we were trapped here. I didn't expect we'd have a game room. Um. Are we really trapped in here? There must be an exit, right? You've still got a ways to go. Is that what you guys are walking around looking for? Then then figure your, out yourself. Oh, okay. However, we may be trapped, but it's pretty cool here. Compared to prison, anyway. God damn it, with the goddamn freezing game! Ah, <sighs> fuck's sake. Come on. Come on, please. Got a goddamn eyelash in my eye. All right. Huh? Prison? But what? But you're an ultimate student, aren't you? That's an old story. Hmm. That's an old story. Ryoma Hoshi, the man called the ultimate tennis pro, no longer exists. I'm nothing more than his empty shell. Oh. Ryoma Hoshi? Really? I've seen you in the newspaper. The tennis prodigy who single-handedly took down a mafia. Huh? You took down a mafia by yourself? I remember correctly. The papers said he shot them through the head with the tennis skills and an iron ball. What the hell? Really? <clears> hmm. <throat> so you know well, that much already. Well, what do you think of the loser before you who uses talent to kill? Um, but, but why would you throw away your future like that? Jeez. <laughs> because I don't need a future anymore. Huh? Huh? No. No, it's nothing. It's not like me to talk so much. More importantly. Anyway, I'm warning you. It's dangerous to just walk up to a killer like me. As he said that, he turned his back to us. Well, damn. <laughs> Hot fucking damn. All right. What's the sliding door? And it's locked. Hmm. It looks like it's locked. Yeah. I wonder what's inside this room. I hope we can investigate it later. Let's hope so. Anyways, let's get the hell out of here. Still, my god. Is that everything? Seems like there's everything in the basement. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. So how many students does that make so far? Come, co Koita. Rules, regulations must be followed. Kaide. Kimiko. Maki. Tenko, Sumugi, Miyu, Suichi, Yoma, 
Rentaro, Kokishi, Kibo. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Five more to go! Where should we go next? <clears throat> oh! The ways. We couldn't go through here before, right? Looks like the iron gate opened. I was just about to mention that. Is someone over for us? Check it out. Oh! Oh! Is this the entrance hall? Right, Suichi? This must be the entrance hall. Don't you think? Uh, okay. Yeah, I suppose. Hey. Which means... Mm -hmm. That door must lead, be the entrance! If we walk through it, we can escape this place, right? No. Wait, I don't think we should open the door so carelessly. Oh, excuse me. Could be a trap. Do not look. Worrying about that isn't necessary. I have already examined the doors. Uh, oh, uh... Yes. You wonder, who is this? Yes, I shall make this that clear first. My name is Karekio Shinguji. I am called the Ultimate Anthropologist. Huh. Karekio? Anthropologist? Oh. Please, call me Kyo. As for anthropology, would you like a simple explanation? I see. Okay, sure. Anthropology is... Anthropology studies customs, legends, folk tales, songs, and much more. There may even be customs in your daily life, the origins of which you do not know. Let's see. For example, certain aspects of birthday or New Year celebrations. Anthropology sheds light on traditions and customs such as these through rigorous analysis. It is a study that examines the thought behind culture, faith, and customs. Mm -hmm. Okay, I sort of get it, but not really. It sounds like a lot of fun, though. What isn't fun is the game freezing again! Oh my god! Come on! Why? What causes this? Jesus. Come on. There we go. That's correct. I'm using the, uh, y'all can't see it, but there's like a little music player on the top left of the screen. It has like the bars behind a thing of the school. I'm um, actually, hang on a second. Really hoping this isn't showing in the gameplay. Uh, hang on. Right here. See? I use that. I'm using that to determine the, uh, the, when the game unfreezes. I'm gonna move my head here just in case. Well, of course it's fun. It is a study focused on humanity. Beautiful. I believe that human beings are creatures who possess infinite beauty. Although in that regard, they're also capable of infinite ugliness. Not just f physical, but also um, personality-wise. My god. Um. Oh, um. Bye. I find all aspects of humanity even the ugly parts to be beautiful. And let's just hope you're not on that part of the ugly part of history, like we are. Our present situation is rather intriguing. What beauty will be able to witness here? Humanity is beautiful. <laughs> People are wonderful. This guy looks like a creep. Turns out he is one too. What is their pron? What are their pronouns? Anyway. We can go outside if we just go through the, these doors, right? If so. You should find the answers to such questions on your own. The moment your hopes are shattered, that too may be beautiful. Shattered? What does that? What do you mean? What does he mean by that? Kurikio. I'm really hoping I'm not butchering that. <clears throat> well, let's see. So that makes twelve. So we only have four more to go. Then let's go. Uh, okay. Determined as I was, I couldn't just- I couldn't muster up the courage to take that first step forward. To be honest, I was scared. Because what if beyond this is just- Jeez, ah, this isn't like me! Just because I'm scared doesn't mean I'm- I gotta run away. I gotta move forward. Are you okay? Kaida! Of course! Don't worry about it. Let's just go, Suichi. I sacked myself up, and with newfound strength, walked boldly through the doors- towards the doors. 
Upon opening the doors, we were immediately greeted by blue skies, bright sunlight, gentle wind, and... Excuse me? Both words were accurate. What stood before us was both cage and wall. Well, that's... Okay then. Either way, the enormous wall struck a terrifying chord. The mere sight of its imposing presence was enough to send waves of panic through me. No matter where we looked, ahead, behind, above, or all around, the cage surrounded the entire school. What is this? We're trapped? What's going on? This is a- God damn it with you fucking crash goblins! Surprised about the cage, huh? I totally understand how you feel. The first time I saw it, my teeth and fingernails fell out. That's not a healthy way to react to a surprise. B.O. But it's so awesomely huge. I can see why it's called the end wall. Huh? End wall? That's right. Normally walls are erected to separate two places, right? But the, this that wall is different. It represents the end of the world. Hey. What are you talking about? What? Hmm. What were we talking about? Yeah. Huh? Is someone talking? Was I talking? <laughs> Ow. Stop laughing and explain yourselves! There's nothing to explain. This is simply how it is. So please don't bother. You can't get out of here. The walls are, has no entrance or exits, and it cannot be climbed or demolished. <clears throat> An ultimate could probably climb it part way, but most of the time it's impossible. But hey. But they can sort of climb it, huh? I take a deep breath and shout out the walls as loud as I can. So how have you guys been? Um, have they been treating you nicely? We had a bit of a cold front in Texas. It snowed for a bit, actually. Oh, there we go. Someone help us! <laughs> Please help us! Heave, heave! Someone, anyone, please help us! We're trapped inside this huge cage! Heave, heave, heave! I shouted as loud as I could, but for all my shouting, there was no response. Stop Please stop! You'll hit your throat! That's right. Yeah, scream all you like! No one can hear you anyway! <coughs> Ow. No one can hear us? What do you mean? What do you mean no one can hear us? Wait. Say something! One of you, just answer! Damn it! Damn it! Hmm. Monodom is ignoring them excellently because he refuses to open his heart. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. You can thank my fierce bullying for making that happen. Hmm. Now, now, let's get along. Dumbass. Shut up! With the monocaps, we need to be tough and whatnot. What is this? You things, this school, what is all this? You bastards will have to use your legs, hands, and eyes to find out what happened for yourselves. But please watch your steps while you explore. The school is still under construction. Huh? Under construction? I looked around. It was true. Some areas did... Hmm, sorry. Some areas did seem as if they were still under construction. It looks like they're still building some of the facilities here. Um, Are they still in the middle of building the school? No. I don't think so. It seems more like they're re renovating an abandoned school. Either way, the construction will finish soon. So we set the Exesels on autopilot. Huh? Exesels? What's part of a biker gang? The Exesels now work construction to support their wives and kids. Do robots really need that kind of backstory? They're steering wheels. 
Their steering wheels are leopard print, and their dashboards are lined up with arcade prizes. This is stupid. Seriously, knock it off, you guys. They sound like douchebags with backstories like those. So long, farewell. I'm starting. I have a bit of an inconsistent voice for the yellow one, and there they go again. But more importantly, is what they said really true? We can't escape. We can't go over the wall. No one's coming to rescue us. Jeez. Oh, but if I give up now, then what? I slapped both my cheeks and my face grew warm. I could feel my determination returning. Hey. Mm. Sorry, doing the lower voices for like the deeper voice characters like Mono Kid really does a number on my throat. Hey, Suichi, let's go. Let's go see if we can find a way out. I, sl <laughs> I slapped him upside his head just firm enough to get his attention. Ow! Ow! You know? Suichi, I'm not great at motivating others, but we can can't give up just because of a wall. We came in somewhere, so there has to be an exit. Yeah, that's right. We may not be able to escape now, but we'll do it eventually, somehow. Yeah. Everyone just has to cooperate if we all want to get out of here. Yeah, that's right. It's too early to give up. It's too early. Student inbound! Oh my god, that is fast! <laughs> that is really fast. Hello? Jeez, how'd they make this big ass wall? Seriously, I just don't get it. I wonder what will happen now if we could escape them. What are you complaining? Huh? What are you complaining? Listen huh? Up. Quit complaining and grumbling, or it'll turn into a habit. Besides, this cage is nothing compared to the vastness of the universe. Um, huh? The universe? Got it. Oops, I haven't introduced myself yet. My bad. Uh, oops, the game froze again. My bad. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So, anyways, about that, uh. That snow I mentioned in Texas? Normally it hardly ever snows, especially with global warming being a thing. But last but a couple nights ago it actually snowed. But sadly, it melted away really quickly. So yeah. But I mean hey, it was nice seeing it snow. I just wish it snowed. Oh, there we go. Oops, my bad. I'm Kaito Momota, luminary of the stars. Even crying children adore the ultimate astronaut. <laughs> I love his voice. It's... Oh my god, that is really fitting for his talent. How about it? I'm an astronaut. Isn't that cool? Yeah, I've never been to space, so I don't know much about it. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> well, of course. Not just anyone can get up there. I may be an astronaut, but I actually still have... I'm actually still in training. I see. Oh, I see. So you're still a trainee. You know. But I'm the first teenager to ever pass the exam. I mean, normally you need a college degree to even take the exam. Huh? huh? And how'd you take the exam? So... I had a friend who was pretty crafty, so I had him force some stuff for me. Oh, That's illegal. Yeah. yeah, and I'm getting caught. I was in pretty deep shit. But the people on up top decided they liked me and let me in anyway. Of course I aced the exam too. Jeez. That's so reckless. Got it. Sometimes you gotta be a little reckless to make your dreams a reality. That is actually true. No way I can wait till after college. I wanna get to space as fast as I can. But... Why does this guy remind me of Mark? You sure have a lot of energy. Got it. Yeah, everyone told me it was impossible, but I never gave up, not for a moment. That's because limits don't exist unless you set them yourself. There are no walls you can get over. You can't get over it, damn it. The same goes for that one. So, you have any ideas? That's not the problem! <laughs> the fucking way he yelled, SHUT UP! I love that. Um, no, that is the problem. Jeez, this guy sure talks a big game. Kaito's report card has been updated based on your experience with him. He's really cool. I'm trying to find, figure out what I can compare his voice to. It's like... It's like that voice on old TVs where it's like, the final frontier! You know that one? It reminds me of that.
Yeah, this place is so much more open than the other one. It's like they combined the the enclosure of the school with the openness of uh, Jabberwock Island. I love it. <gasps> You're the big guy I like I've heard about so much. You seem cool. Whoa, this guy looks scary. He's so big and muscular. Just like his heart. Um, excuse me? Huh? Hmm? Thank you. Oh, thank you. Huh? Huh? Thank you. Sorry. Oh, oh sorry for scaring you. Um. Gonta scary looking. Oh my god! Yes! I remember this! Gonta scary looking. Most people not want to talk to Gonta when meeting for first time. Gonta gentleman. Oh my god, I love him already! So, like gentlemen, Gonta say thank you. Thank you for talking to Gonta. Yeah. Um, thank you for being so polite. He looks scary, but he doesn't seem very scary at all. Oh, oh, right. Gonta need to make introduction. Um, Gonta's name is Gonta <laughs> Gokuhara. Uh, Gonta's talent is ultimate entomologist. Oh my God, I love you. Gonta want to become gentleman, becoming true gentleman. Gonta's goal. I love you so much. <laughs> He's so cool. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. God damn it. <clears throat> So, oh, so you're Gonta. That's a really cute name. Huh? Really? But thank you. Yeah. Uh, you're actually pretty nice. It's still me for being so scared at first. Maybe. Oh, Gonta, scary looking, huh? Sorry. Sorry, that's not what I... No, no it okay, is okay. Gonta used to it. Gonta called scary since he was kid. Um, since you were a kid, huh? Oh, Gonta's... Kid Gonta bigger than other kids. Other kids scared of Gonta. So kid Gonta play alone. That how Gonta come to like bugs. But when Gonta really focus, it's easy to lose track. One day, Gonta go to forest to find bugs, and up lost. That sounds rough. Were they able to find you right away? Mm. Yeah, took ten years. TEN YEARS?! Oh my god! Huh? <laughs> my sentiment exactly, Kaida. Ten years?! It's gonna take 10 years for this fucking game to pass if it keeps freezing like this! It's so weird! It's like only certain things in the game freeze. Like, you see the text scrolling in the music player on the top left is, like, still scrolling, but everything else is frozen! In the UI, it's so weird! Why? What, what? What? I don't get it! I, there we go. But, but Gonta fine. New family took care of Gonta. I see. I'm glad they were nice people. Um, um not people. Wolves. Wolves? What? Oh my god, again. But they really nice. Cause the forest family going to learn to speak bug and animal. Going to... Oh my god, he's so precious. I love him! As thanks, going to want to show forest family what great gentleman Gonta is. Um, how is becoming a gentleman going to thank them for that? This place is strange, huh? Lots of plants, but no bugs. Huh? Wait, really? I suppose it's understandable that there are no animals, but no insects? That's strange. Not even one bug. Yeah, I'm right here. Not you. Damn it. You like bugs too? Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's scary! <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Just Jesus Christ. Hey, what's your favorite bug? What do you like about them? Uh, no, 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 I wasn't saying that I like bugs or anything. Wait. Then you hate bugs? What? Ow. You hate bugs? Um, you don't hate bugs. You love them, right, Suichi? Okay. Yeah, of course I do. I love bugs. Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's Thank terrifying! Goodness. Oh, okay. That good. Not bad person like bugs. That was scary. <laughs> oh god, I'm really sorry y'all had to hear me s shout like that. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah. I thought you were gonna die. Honestly, I can't stand bugs either, but it might be best to hide that. <sighs> Don't make the precious man angry. Noted. What the hell? Um. Is that a ninja statue? You're right. It looks like one, but why is it here? Seriously, there are so many odd things. 
They really perfected the 3D environments since Despair Girls, honestly. I like this. Anyone here? Ooh! Hi! I think I saw you in a few screenshots. Talking about... I don't know. Hang on, gotta collect some change. I keep forgetting to do this. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't worry, this is normal. This is normal, folks. Everything else? Okay, we're good. Hello. <clears throat> Yaha. <clears throat> Yaha, how are you? My name is Angie Yonaga. I'm the ultimate artist. Oh, cool. You look cute. I like you. You're pretty cheerful. She's a bit too happy considering the situation we're in right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> There's no reason to carry bad thoughts with you. You gotta live every day you like this bright, cheery, and fun. So says Atua. Huh? Uh, Atua? I... The god of my island. Atua is always nice with me, speaking to me his divine voice. Oh, well, she's certainly devout. Uh... <clears throat> Do you specialize in painting or sculpting? Uh... Hmm. I do both. I paint paintings and I sculpt sculptures. But Atua is the one who makes the art. I merely offer my body as his vessel. So divine! <laughs> How divine! I see. I see. That's interesting. If you don't mind, can you show me some of your artwork? Of course, of course! Oh my god, I love her already. Of course, of course! In return, will you make an offering? Um... An offering? Every Monday and Wednesday morning on my island, a truck comes to collect offerings. That sounds oddly similar to putting out tr the trash for pickup. But, but... Does this, does this feel racy to anyone? Or am I just being paranoid? Don't worry, don't worry. When I say offerings, I just mean a p pint or two of your blood. Don't... worry? Sorry. Um, I am a bit an anemic, so I'll pass. Oh god fucking damn it with this goddamn freaking game! Just give it a sec. Any minute now. Mind if I talk about more about that snow in Texas? It was like a couple of centimeters. Like honestly, it wasn't that deep. Which really which is really sad. Oh, oh, there we go. I see. <clears throat> I see. I see. I can't. I, I just want to fall out when I do when I do Angi. I see. What about you then? Huh? huh? Me? Uh, yep. Boy's blood is also an acceptable offering. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. It won't hurt one bit. Uh. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, come on. <laughs> Don't run away. This girl is so weird. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know if, like, this is considered racy, but I still love her. She... <laughs> I, may, I may be biased. Shut up. I may be biased. Anyways, where have we not explored yet? Hmm. Oh, there's something on the left there. But it's blocked off. Is there a way to get around it? Oh, come on! <clears throat> there's no railing here. Just go around! Jesus Christ. All right. Fine. Anyways. Something to the right of us here. Also blocked off. The blocked off this side? Mm hmm. This side. That's back to the dining hall. <clears throat> Let me let me check the uh, the handbook and see if there's anyone else we're missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There's just one more. Where could he be though? I'm not sure. But fine. Oh wait, dormitory. This building is round and has a lot of smaller rooms inside. Very nice to see you. <laughs> God damn it. Very 
nice to see you again. Why, hello there. Where Abel, hello going? there. Sorry to intrude. Please. What is it this time? And what do you mean by intruding? What are you saying? Because this is your home, you bastards. <laughs> <laughs> we finished setting up the showers. Now you can go pee. Hey. Why don't they just use the toilets? Uh, huh? Even for number two? Ah. Wait, you don't... Amazing adventure Excuse me. Wait, you go number two in the sh showers? Whoa. Ew, that's gross. So long, I did not need to know you did that. Um. What do you mean? What do they mean, our home? Could it be... They mean for us to live here? See? They mean for us to live here. See? There are 16 doors. Perhaps a room for each of us? Stop it. I don't plan on staying here long enough to need a room. <clears throat> oh, that's freaking cool. I love this design. Anyways. I failed to see their objective. Um, huh? What do you mean? If they are holding us for ransom, a large facility such as this would be unnecessary. Furthermore, I gather where they would rather care for us than hurt us. In light of this, I fail to see the true objective of the culprits responsible for kidnapping us. Culprits, huh? I never even thought of that. Why would our kidnappers go to all this trouble? Sixteen ultimate students have been gathered here, but why? What's the reason? Excuse me. <clears throat> Pardon me, I have not introduced myself yet. I'm Toji, the ultimate maid. Please let me know if you require my service. Your voice sounds oddly familiar. <clears throat> I swear I've heard your voice somewhere before. I have to look up the INDB after this. Wow, the ultimate maid. Sounds like a really cool talent. Ah, oh. oh, wait, I've heard of Kirumo Tocho. Toho, Tocho. Ultimate with incredible intellect and strength, working as a private maid. I hear that her work is so perfect, she can complete any request given to her. Can she can she fulfill the request of making this game not freeze? I swear I'm not doing this for a bit. This is really starting to irritate me. Jesus. My god. Alright. Gotta play the waiting game again. Oh my me, just scrolling through Discord. There we go. Huh? <laughs> what? She's that amazing? I do not agree. Please, you are exaggerating. I will not completely end any request that is asked of me. I once received a request to annihilate a rival nation, but as it is, was impossible, I rejected it. But being requested to do that is pretty impressive on its own. That's true. Mm. I've also heard that she's been hired as a bodyguard for several foreign di dignitaries. Yeah, dignitaries. I do not agree. I have only been employed as a maid, not a bodyguard. But you've been hired by so many important people. You're like a super maid. May I? <clears throat> Sorry. Moving on, what do you intend to do now? Hmm. That's a tough question. Um, what should we do? Um. What do you do, Kir Kirumi? I do not agree. I hold no opinions or desires of which to speak. I am a maid, after all. As a maid, my only desire is to fulfill the desires of others. So please, think about what you desire for yourself and what you desire from me. No matter the situation, no matter what happens, I am here to serve everyone. Even in this situation, she's more concerned for others. Well, she is the ultimate maid after all. And that's all 16! <clears throat> huh? Was that the bell? Kaidi, look, the monitor! Okay, then. What's with all the dolls? I just noticed that. Hi! Thanks for bearing with us! You bastards! Kept you bastards waiting, huh? All right. Everyone, make your way to the gym, please! 
The opening ceremony can finally begin! Phew, we finally finished our preparations. Hey. Do you realize you just read your lines backwards, don't you? So long, farewell. Well then. Jim? Opening ceremony? Hey. Kaida, what should we do? Um, what should we do? Go, of course. Everyone else is probably doing the same thing. You're right. True, but I'm a little worried about this. Well, I'm not a little worried. I'm very worried. As for me, I'm gonna go, uh... I'm gonna go, uh, get up and stretch real quick. Maybe get something to eat, because I am hungry. We are back.
Welcome back, sports fans! We got ourselves a hefty game today! And by hefty game, I mean we got our students going to the gym. But, hell yeah, I'm back. Oh, wait, hang on. <laughs> Hi, how y'all doing? I'm back. Sorry, I, uh, went to go get something to eat, walk around a bit. Should be good. Um, I think we're close to the end of the prologue, actually. So, hopefully, we should be able to finish the stream off soon. I don't know how soon, but soon, because we've been going for about three hours, including the fucking time they spent waiting. Where's the gym? Classroom, restrooms, store, um, warehouse, dining hall. Should I go on a... Oh, wait. It's down here somewhere, isn't it? No. <clears throat> Where's the gym? Hold on a sec. No, no. Where the hell is the gym? And it froze again. Come on! Hurry up. I, I don't have all day. Also, hi, guy. I didn't notice you in the chat. Oh, speaking of chat, um, while I was in... Oh, there it is. Okay. Go to the entrance hall real quick, so it should be... What the hell? Where the fuck am I? Um, also, my friend wanted to say that they say hi. What is this? Oh, damn it. Oh, we just need to go through the hall. Okay, I'm an idiot. My friend Rat says hi to you guys. Um, he's a really big fan of this game. Or at least one of the characters in this game. Seems like everyone heard the announcement. <clears throat> I thought this was the gym. Oh, wait. I remember this. There we go. Do you agree? Hey everyone. All 16 of us have gathered. Mm. Hmm. This is pretty spectacular seeing all 16 of us ultimates gathered together. <laughs> you may not be able to be so easy going for much longer. Um, in this situation, it's no use thinking about things, so eventually Samuki Stop thinking. There we go. Yeah. What happened to us? I bet it'll be a big pain. Hmm. Hmm. What? what? What are you looking at? Himiko. Um, Himiko! You can use amazing powers, right? Because you're a psychic and stuff, right? It's magic. I'm not a psychic. I'm a mage. Ah! Whoa! That's amazing! I definitely want to incorporate that into Neo Aikido. Hey, what sort of training do you undergo D D to gain your awesome powers? God damn it. I'm having a stroke. Talking about it is so tiring. You're pretty lazy. Please wait. Pardon me, but we need to be on our guard. We do not know if and when danger will strike. Please don't. D don't say that. I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. It'll be okay. There is no need to worry. Atua will protect us. Oh, goodness. Phew, that's a relief. It's your is your brain full of weeds or something? I'll whack him out with that skull of yours. Don't worry about it. What a dick. Don't worry about it. Just leave it to me. Leave it to me. If those teddy bears show themselves again, I'll kick all their asses. Wonder... Huh? What's that? What's wrong? Hmm? What's wrong? See? The short one kind of sounds like Gundam. 
Listen, hear that? Ah, I think I hear it. It sounds like an engine from a robot anime. And here they are again. And they appear again. Everyone! Everyone! Behind Gonta! What? what the heck are these monsters? Wow, so cool! Hell yeah! They're Exiles! Highly mobile bipedal weapon platforms! They got lots of hometown pride too! What are you saying? I can't keep track of these backstories. <laughs> Whatever they are, they better. To kill off the uggos and save me for last. Hey! Run, Himiko. Why are you so concerned about me all of a sudden? By the way. Hmm. Didn't someone call say they would kick all their asses? Oh. What the hell? Nobody told me about these. Okay. All right, chill out. No need to panic. We're probably not in any danger. If they wanted to kill us, they'd have done it by now. With that, Rantaro casually walked up to the Exiles. Exi... Ex... Ex... So what do you want from us? You clearly want something. That's what the guns are for, right? Let me guess. You're gonna force us to do something? And if we don't, we get hurt. Well, if you have our attention. You have our attention, so what do you want? And that's that! Hmm. Actually, can I try? I don't know how the well this is gonna sound. Huh. I want you a wise guy. I'll start us off! Loosen up! Here's what we want you podcasters to do! Oh, my heart's going 100 miles! Oh, god damn it! The fucking guy froze! God fucking damn it. Alright. <coughs> Christ. Try again. Any minute now. There we go. Ah, my heart's going 100 miles per hour. I'm gonna say, you ready? Hell yeah, it's a, it's a killing game. Killing game. Huh? What? Oh shit, hold on. What? <laughs> Monodom, how dare you upstage me? Huh? Wait a second. What did you say? Hmm. If I heard him correctly. It's a killing game. It's a killing game. Oh, he said it again! God damn it, Monodom! I'm gonna crush you with this here exosol! Come on, we don't have time to fight amongst ourselves. Okay. Yeah, if we don't stop fighting, I'm gonna crush you with the, with this here exosol. You too, Monotaro? <laughs> oh my god. She said Usami's uh, phrase. If this is what it comes to, then I'll crush the four of you with this here exosol. What are you saying? Hey, what are you tr Hey, why are you including me? Oh well. oh well, it's more appropriate for us to be hostile to each other. You wanna go, Jabroni? <laughs> Who are you calling Jabroni, Jabroni? What the fuck is happening? What'd you say, Jabroni? I'll throw down any time, Jabroni! Check yourself before you wreck yourself! Um, Monodom, you mind stopping Seriously? your siblings? Are they gonna get it on right in front of us? The fuck are you t Dude! Don't worry. Atsua is watching over us. In a situation like this, is he just going to watch? Either way, it's too dangerous. We need to get out of here, or else... Now, now, now! Oh, here I come! <laughs> what? My cute little cubs. You gotta knock off this awful fighting! Oh my god, he sounds so weird. <laughs> father! Father! Is that you? Papa <laughs> oh my god. Papa Kuma! Papa Kuma! Daddy? Daddy? Where are you, Daddy? Huh? Daddy? Here I come! At that moment, the lights in the gymnasium suddenly shut off. Uh, 
Drum roll, please. What the fuck? Oh my god, why do I sound like that? Have I always sounded like that? Oh, Jesus. And the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy! Oh, Jesus Christ! The one, the only, Monokuma! Nice to meet ya! Yay! Oh, why do I sound like that? I mean, I knew I had a high-pitched voice, but Jesus! I don't remember sounding like that! Yay! Father's here! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Another epic entrance from Papa Kuma! That is so cool! My cute little cubs! You're all so freaking cute! The only reason I can tolerate your tiresome antics is because you're all so cute! Even when the prologue is going away too long, Allow it because you guys are so cute. Even I know I look very pissed off, but trust me, I'm very entranced by their cuteness. In fact, the very first prologue ever was only short because you cutie patooties weren't there. Pops! Pops, are you mad at us? Don't be, Don't be an idiot! I would never get mad at my cutie little cubs! <laughs> oh, he is mad! But Daddy is so cool even when he's angry. Why does this feel weird? That's right. Pops is from a planet of handsome bears that gets cooler as they get angrier. It's getting interesting. Super Monokuma, Super Monokuma 2, Super Monokuma 3, and finally Super Monokuma 4. Oh god damn it, the game froze again! <sighs> Give it a second. I'll probably explode it in the next scene. You show him, Papa. I'm showing you. Oh shit. Why am I doing this with my shirt? Jesus. <sighs> Any minute now! Come on. Any minute now. There we go! I'm vibrating mad! I sound so weird. What's going on? Ah, father just transformed into a super monokuma god, super monokuma. That's a mouthful. That's only possible when six monokumas of pure heart are gathered together. What is this, an RPG? It's the power you bust out when you really want to fuck the world shit up. A power you only see when the gods themselves do battle. I wouldn't say that, but you know. Anyway. Anyway, I'm not really mad. In fact, I gotta admit that I'm actually proud of you guys. You kids really stand out from the rest of the second generation of failures in the world. No way. Isn't that a little harsh? I'm sure there are some second generation success stories. Yeah, but. I can't think of any though. <clears throat> What is this voice? Who oh, did. Is this a different voice actor? I swear this sounds radically different. Or did he. Do, or did the same voice actor just do like really high pitched voice? I don't know. This sounds weird. But father remembers because he knows everything. Holy shit! That's right, Papa Kuma. You know all kinds of useless crap. Uh, you might want to watch your mouth, kid. His daddy gets all his alternate facts. From the most trusted names in fake news. Yeah, like Facebook. Wait, no, not Facebook. We are not advertising Facebook on this stream. <laughs> I love embracing my children. They're so cute. I just can't help myself. Usually the ratings will plummet when mascots appear in sequels too much. But guess but uh, ah, 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 <laughs> let me try again. But in this case, ratings are through the roof! All thanks to the cute monocubs! What is this? What's going on? Another teddy bear just appeared. Yes, but that is no ordinary teddy bear. 
I can see it. The despair... No, oh, excuse me. The despair and madness swirling around that cursed thing. You're really bugging me. Alright, that's more like it. Wow, first of all, I am no teddy bear. I'm Monokuma. And show some respect. I'm the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy of Gifted Juveniles. Huh? Headmaster? Mm -hmm. It appears to be some sort of autonomous robot with a built-in AI, like me. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> yeah, but... The Exiles are different, though. That brainless bucket of bolts. That's right. They're mindless, pretty killing machines that can only be controlled by us, the Monocubs. Automaton robots piling weapons platforms. This is certainly turning into quite the story. Well, that may be. What I'm worried about is the killing game you mentioned. What exactly does that mean? How? <laughs> what is so amusing? Yeah. It's just when I said it before, I kind of just phoned it in, and now I feel awkward. I want you students with your ultimate level talents to participate in a killing game. Killing game? Us? Please stop joking! Why would we agree to participate in the killing game? Huh? huh? You guys don't want to do it? Don't you ever do that? Of course not! Gentlemen, not hurt people! But if you looked around the academy, then you already know, don't you? The academy is surrounded by a huge wall. You can't escape to the outside world. As long as we have the Exeusals, you can't defy us. In other words, I hold the power of life and death over each and every one of you! So unsure. <coughs> oh my gosh. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> so, do. So, do. What you say if we don't want to die? Oh no! Come on! This is my moment! Why would you freeze up now of all times? Ah, I guess we gotta play the waiting game instead! Damn it all to hell! <sighs> so, uh... Oh, there we go! You gotta be kidding me! You gotta be kidding me! Why would friends kill each other? Oh? Who said you guys were friends? No way! You guys are friends at all! <laughs> Your enemies are to kill each other! Huh? <sighs> I remember when I used to kill like that. Such good memories. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Enemies? We're enemies? Hmm, I still have a lot to learn from father about sarcasm. All this talk is bugging the shit out of me! I gotta beat up Monotom to relieve the stress! But I don't like that. I'm not good with violence or gore or sad situations. Um, Daddy, instead of a killing game, can we do Rock, Paper, Scissors tournament? Stupid! You wanna play a game where no one dies? Hmm. Well, you do have a compassionate personality. It's so cute, I can barely stand it! Yeah, so <clears throat> Excuse me. Why, it's so cu cute enough to eat! Cute enough that I wanna eat it! Huh? Eh? Hey. Hey, Mono Fanny. Mono Fanny? I, I just noticed that. What the fuck? Nope. Oh, it said no data for a second there, so I thought the stream was lagging out. What the fuck? Hey, Mono Fanny. You might want to dial back the cute shtick for a bit. Cool it with the stupid banter. I want to ask something. How are we supposed to kill each other? Are you going to give us weapons? What the hell, man? What are you asking? We need to get info from them first. We can't do anything if we don't know anything. No way! Weapons? Huh? What kind of barbaric display are you envisioning? You couldn't be more wrong. Excuse me, hang on. <clears throat> what? The juvenile. <laughs> Damn it. Why? At the juvenile. Fuck's sake! Why? At the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles! There we go. The killing game is quite the refined, sophisticated experience. What? Sophisticated experience? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Here, the killing game is punctuated by class try. <clears throat> Uh, she's sorry. Class trials? Okie dokie! Okay, let us explain. Alright, so if one of you men 
targets kill someone, you all gotta take part in a class trial. The class trial is where the blackened killer faces off against their spotless classmates. It's where you punk ass bitches argue over who you fucking think the blackened is. After that, it's voting time! And if the majority of you idiots vote correctly... It's weird that Monica gives me an Audrey 2 vibe sometimes. Then only the Blackens killer will receive p -p punishment Punishment! <laughs> I love the way she said that. <clears throat> so girl, just imagining all the bloody guard makes me want to puke. After the Blackened is punished, the rest of you will just keep right on living together. But if you vote for the wrong person during the class trial, the Blacken gets off scot-free, and all the spotless students get punished instead. <clears throat> yep. Different first, same as the first, and second. Hell yeah! <clears throat> Them's the rules of the class trial! Woo-hoo-hoo! Oh! Come on, kid, shut the fuck up, I'm clearing my throat. <clears throat> <clears throat> Jesus. Jesus Christ, what the hell is that sprite? Uh, who drew that? <sighs> That's weird. Huh. <sighs> too much. That explanation revealed way too much. I think his tongue is way too much too. Who the, who drew this? Who thought it was a good idea? But it can't make sense because, you know, kiss, long tongues. It makes sense there. Why do you have a long tongue on me? Jesus. Ah, uh, God. Don't give the internet more ideas. You gotta be more coy, flirtatious, seductive, just like your old man. <sighs> Not freeze up like this broken game. <laughs> hey, damn it! Who programmed this? Who put this in the PC? I'll, I'll give them the worst punishment that I can think of. As soon as I think of it. I want to go fucking any minute now. There we go. Gross. Agreed. Real gross. Hey, um. I'm not exactly he here to complain. I'm just following the script. The point is, it's not enough to kill someone. You also have to survive the class trial. How should I put this? Kill without being caught, and then survive the trial. Sounds eerily similar to the real world. Or Among Us. What? Nothing! Unbelievable. You think so? Then the outside world must be masterfully designed, even at the cruelest. Listen. One can likely imagine, but I shall ask just in case. What is the punishment you mentioned earlier? Yeah! Simply put, it's an execution! <clears throat> execution? Thinking of that's more like it. Why couldn't the voice actor do this more often? It works so much better in the older games. Jesus. Hell yeah! Ooh, I wonder what kind of punishments there'll be. Lots of blood and guts and brains, I bet. The kind of stuff that gives me a raging. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, a lot more euphemisms this time around. Yeah, no kidding. I mean, y'all are children, aren't you? Like, it, it, it just feels weird. Oh, God, this is weird. What? Honey, kid, you already have a boner? We're, we're kids. I know! I'm not the one who wrote that script, man! Just go with it! I guess. You're a time ranger. Uh, why? Yeah, I'm so hard right now. Oh, Jesus Christ. How gory! Blood, guts, brains, boners. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Oh, <clears throat> Whoa, Mana Fanny just puked. Oh, God, please stop making me say this. I'm so freaking hard. Yeah. <laughs> Hughes gives you a boner, too? No, no, it doesn't. This is weird. <laughs> <laughs> ah, 
you kids are just adorable. What? What the hell is cute about that? Well, now. All right, I'm over this boring exposition. Kills, kills, kills. Let's get this heart pounding, killing school semester started already. You have free reign to murder however you like, too. Like bludgeoning or stabbing. Feeling cheap? Try strangulation. Feeling lazy? Try poisoning! Whether you shoot, burn, drown, blow up, crush, electrocute, or laugh your victim to death. I swear, sometimes it sounds like the original actor, and sometimes it just doesn't. Who the fuck voice acting me this game? You can use any method you like to kill anybody you like, any way you like. At the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles, you will realize your murderous potential! I'm already feeling my murderous potential just hearing this voice! Ah. Sixteen talented teenage prodigies, all competing for first place in a killing game! There's no better setting for an event like this than the Ultimate Academy! Oh my god, please stop talking! You got me. Killing school semester. It's like a game. <laughs> Risking our lives for some silly games absurd. But... It does seem like it'll be boring though. <clears throat> hey, how can you degenerates be so calm? It can't be. This has to be a lie, right? It's a lie, right? A lie. More like fiction. Like a story on TV. <clears throat> Why is the screen so wavy now? A scenario so removed from reality, we can hardly believe it's happening. <sighs> it froze again! What is happening? Why? I just noticed that Gunter is, is barefoot. <laughs> oh my god. There we go. <clears throat> it's no use. I, I don't want to be in a killing game. It's wrong. I, I never do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't want to participate in a killing game. That's going to be a problem. Because a killing game is the only reason you're here. <clears throat> what? Now then, unleash your talent and have a healthy, homicidal, horrific, hilarious killing game. Oh, wait just a minute! Uh -oh. <clears throat> hmm? Stop it. No matter what you say, we won't do it! Let's we'll never participate in a killing game! Okay. Whatever you have planned, I'm not gonna let you get away with it! Um... Kaida, you shouldn't just rashly defy that thing. That's no, nice. no! I welcome her resistance! That kind of defiant spirit is important to the killing game! <clears throat> Excuse me! <clears throat> Ah, my voice actor can only handle so much of me. Jesus, it's fun to watch the defiant ones eventually snap and get their hands dirty. What do you mean by that? Love Everyone loves that kind of brutality in a death game, especially me. It never gets old. It's so fun and entertaining that I just get unbearably pumped up. Plus, as the headmaster, it's my job to force you to do it. Well, at least that part sounds normal. <laughs> uh, he stood in dumbfounded silence, surrounded by the squealing laughter of Monokuma and his cubs. Everything about this situation was so messed up. <clears throat> An academy surrounded by a giant wall, 16 ultimate students trapped inside, mysterious stuffed bears and deadly weapons? And new friends forced to play some killing game? It all felt like something out of a sadistic work of fiction. Well, that's because it is. What? Nothing! A sadistic story no different from reality itself. And against my will, I was now a character in that story. This feels like foreshadowing. <gasps> oh, the intro! I was wondering where that went. Hopefully we'll play it from now on. Hey, 
is great. <clears throat> oh, that's intimidating. Hello! Goodbye! <laughs> oh, lordy. This is nuts. children. Oh my god, this is so cool! I love this! <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. This is really stylish. There we go. There we go. <clears throat> Almost slipped into my Monokuma voice again. For the ultimate cold open! Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles badge. <sighs> it froze again. It froze again. It froze again. It froze again. It froze a fucking gen. <sighs> Come on. There we go. <clears throat> Would you like to save? Yeah, I'd like to save. And the dogs are barking. Well, I'm going to be ending the stream soon anyway, so whatever. After Monokuma and the Mono Cubs left, an alarm suddenly rang from my mono pad. Not just from mine, the alarm was going off throughout the whole gym. Which meant everyone else had received a mono pad as well. <clears throat> when I took mine out, a message was displayed on the screen. The ultimate! God damn it! Seasons must live as the ultimate academy for the remainder of their foreseeable future. Once a murder takes place, all surviving students must participate in a class trial. If the Blacken is exposed, lose the class trial, they will get executed. If the Blacken is not exposed, the remaining students will be executed. If the Blacken survives the class trial, they will graduate and re-enter the outside world. The killing game and class trials will continue until only one surviving student remains. My time is from 10 p.m. to 8 a.m. The dining hall and gymnasium are off limits at, the at night. Violence towards Monokuma and the Handmaster of the Ultimate Academy is strictly prohibited. Monokuma will never directly commit a murder. Your monopath is a very important items. Please do not damage them. The body discovery announcement will play when three or more students discover a body. <clears throat> With minimal restrictions, you are free to explore the campus at your discretion. Students who violate these rules will be immediately exterminated by the ex Exesils. Exesils. Ex Exesils. How the fuck do you pronounce that? <clears throat> Jesus, the headmaster may add new regulations to this list at any time. You gotta be kidding me. I will never, I will never participate in a killing game. My class trial, our class trial, daily life. I think after... <clears throat> I think after this scene plays out, it might be a good time to end the stream. The Ultimate Academy for gif Gifted Juvenile School Regulations. So these are rules. Wow. <clears throat> I do not understand why someone would force us to do this. But... But the regulations are pretty cut and dry. This game doesn't seem like it will be boring. Me. That's not the problem! Listen. Please, lower your voice. It is ruining the atmosphere. Oh, yeah! Hey, hey! What does the sixth grade regu sixth regulation mean? 
The killing game and class trials will continue until only two surviving students remain. Only two surviving students? What would be the reason for that? That's... Perhaps it's because you couldn't do a class trial with just two people? I see, I see! <laughs> I see, I see! You're so smart, Shuichi. Shuichi. Ah, damn it. <clears throat> Always messing around. Quit screwing around. Killing games, school regulations. Don't screw around! To hell with that crap! Who'd go along with something like that? Kaito raised the monopad as if to smash the device on the ground. Whoa, hey now, do not do that. School rules say you can't break it. Hmm. If you violate the rules, then the Exesils will dispose of you. I don't care about the rules! No way I'm gonna play this messed up game! This isn't about playing the game. It's too dangerous to disobey him now. Yeah. Forget about him! Just means one less dumbass for the world to deal with! Yeah. Hey, who are you calling a dumbass? I took a deep breath and shouted with all my might. Oh, hey! Quit fighting already! Whoa! Whoa, what the- Jeez. We shouldn't be fighting amongst ourselves! Right now, we need to work together! Hmm. Honestly, I'm, I'd probably be more inspiring if I played a song like give a speech. Mm -hmm. Choppin's military points, whatever that means, would definitely help us unite. Right? <clears throat> yeah, I could get behind some baloney. Who's? Baloney? Baloney? I don't know. And I don't eat from Mike Meter Tomatoes. I do Kaida, too. We must remember who the real enemy is. Master told me that strength must always be aimed to the proper direction. Anyways, no panicking too much. Just stay calm. Well, like me. Look at me! I just stopped shaking all together. I'm so calm. Well, that or the game froze again. <laughs> Hurry up! Come on! I don't have all day. Excuse me. Wow, you're shaking so much. I mean, I can't handle these intense vibrations. And trust me, I got loads of experience. Hey. Anyways, why don't we work together and search for an exit one more time? But we've looked all over that wall, and there hasn't been a single hole. There was a single Please hole. Wait. Now, wait a second. If there's no opening in the wall, then how do we get inside these walls in the first place? Uh -huh. Oh, good point. Got it? That means there must be an opening somewhere. <clears throat> Sorry. We just have to find it. Hmm. Whoever trapped us here wants us to fight each other. Oh, right. So let's show them what we're we're gonna. Hmm. So let's show them that we're not gonna let that happen. We're not gonna fight each other. We're gonna work together, okay? Um. Why are you so quiet? Did I say something wrong? I do not agree. On the contrary. You made your case with such... I don't know what that means. So seen to a poem that we've been rendered speechless. <laughs> I was going to say some, the same thing, but you beat me to it. Got it. You're exactly right. We can't give up so easily. Come on, come on. Let's split up and try to find an exit. Oh. Ooh, I just want to give us strength. Oh, impressive. I must admit, I admire your spirit. Hey. Oh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. What is it? We're just about to get started. Um, um, maybe it not matter much, but going to find manhole earlier in grass behind school building. Huh? A manhole? Going to peek in, see big underground passages. Think maybe it exits. What? Sorry, it's probably not so simple. You gotta mention important stuff like that much faster. Going to peek in, see. Look. <laughs> See underground passage. Think maybe exit. No. Hey, not like that. You're talking too fast. The boiler is behind the school building. We must collaborate in Gonta's claim at once. Gonta, please lead the way. Got it. Okay, everyone, follow Gonta. I love him so much. With Gonta leading us, we hurried out of the gym. This one I was about to follow after them. Wow, impressive. Ka Kaede, that was pretty cool back there. Huh? Huh? What was? The way you changed the mood completely seems like everyone looks up to you. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm running on my sentences. 
looks up to me. Come on, that's ridiculous. I just spoke from the heart is all. So unsure. So it comes naturally to you then. That's even more cool. <laughs> you have what it takes to win. Huh? What? That means. I was think just thinking. What you said back there would have pissed off whoever's running this. They definitely don't want us holding hands working together. I'm sure. They're going to come for you, Kaede. With everything they've got. I'm a little worried about you. You're just so straightforward. Well, that was ominous. <clears throat> and away he goes. Like I could really stand to be less cryptic. That's true. Uh, perhaps it's a warning? That's what I think, anyways. Being strong will could get you in a lot of trouble around here. Sorry. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to sound so negative at a time like this. No. It's fine. You only said that because you're worried, aren't you? But... Yeah, Rentaru is a mystery. He forgot his ultimate talent as well. Is that something you can really forget? Mm -hmm. Well, there's no use thinking about it right now. We should just head to that manhole. Okay. Ah, you're right. And I am going to save an exit right here because... Oof. How do I save? There we go. <clears throat> All right, well, I'm gonna end the stream here. Holy shit, this, production-wise, this is already amazing. And I'm super excited to see what happens next, but, whew, my God, that was a lot. So honestly, <laughs> I don't see why Monica was so mad about the pro prologue taking so long. I mean, Christ, the other prolong prologues were just as long. Damn. Alright, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. You guys have fun. Thank you so much for watching this, and I hope to see y'all in the next stream. Bye! Thank you.